a a test 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 one two one two ah uh, ah uh, test completed hello gamers hello 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 welcome in ladies and little men welcome in boys and girly pops hello everybody what's up today we are playing gasp Genshin Impact. Welcoming gamers, welcome in. Today we are playing the 4.1 story quest for Genshin Impact. I have no idea how long it is, but I'm excited to figure out what is going to be happening next in the story. Hello everybody, hello, hello. This isn't a train game. It is not a train game. Man, we played all the Hoyo games this week. We played Star Rail on Tuesday. We played Impact on uh, Honkai Impact on on Wednesday, and now we're playing Genshin Impact on Thursday. Hoyo has us by the throats, gamers. But we are here and we are excited. Um, did you guys see the new characters? You guys, did you guys see the new characters that got announced? Uh, uh um, Ar Argenti, um, um, Hanya, Huo 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 Huo. I don't know how to pronounce that one. Hanya looks great, you guys. Oh my gosh. I saw her and I was like, yeah, damn. Thank God she's a four star. Although four stars are really dangerous territory because uh, you're not guaranteed a four star. You're guaranteed a five star, but but not a four star. Hua Hua is Sucrose and Hu Tao had a baby. I could see it. I could see it. How are you guys? Welcome in gamers. Today, I was at the salon for most of the day. I woke up at like 8 a.m. And I had to leave the house at like nine and I didn't get back home till like four because I was sitting at the salon for over five hours just doing my hair. Uh, but I think it came out really good. I, I think it came out. I think it came out really, really nice. Um, I, I posted a picture on Twitter. Uh, here, I'll show you guys. Boom. Immersion breaking. Immersion breaking. Whoa, my VTuber isn't anime in real life. That's crazy. Isn't it? Does it look nice though? I see skin. You do see skin. Wow. I came home and my dad was like, you look like a skunk. <laughs> Wait, this, this isn't AI. <laughs> like, it's, it's skunk aesthetic. It's skunk aesthetic. First stream and you get to see VTuber IRL. This is the most you guys are ever getting. You'll never see my face, but you guys can see my hair. Doesn't it look nice? I, th I think it came out really nice. I, I really like it. Um, I was there for a long time because, like, the hair, I had to, like, lighten it because I was, I was, like, I was straight brunette, so I had to, you know, lighten it, so it took a minute, and by that, it took, like, five freaking hours to do it, but yeah, I really like how it, I really like how it came out, um, I wanted to go with something a little bit more subtle, but I still wanted to dye my hair, so I thought maybe half, like, half up, half down, so, like, just, like, the bottom, like, the underneath layer on the bottom, I wanted to be, like, that color, and then, and then the rest was just my natural hair color, but yeah, someone was shocked I was a brunette. And I feel like I've stated on multiple accounts that I'm a brunette. My model's a brunette. Like, why, like, like, like why would I be anything other than a brunette in real life? I, I don't understand. I feel like that's the most common hair color. Like, what do you... I, I, was, I was shocked, you guys. I was shocked. It, like, it was like, you're a brunette? Y yeah, yeah. AI lies and propaganda. I, I know. I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I just... I'm so sorry I lied to you guys just blatantly to your face. Like, how are you guys ever going to forgive me? I'm not actually an anime girl. Um, I, I know. I know your disappointment is is immeasurable. Um, you'll never recover from this. It's 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 truly it's truly heart wrenching. She's actually blonde and dyed her hair brown. Bruh, bruh. <laughs> Why do y'all think Mina likes blonde so much? She doesn't want to look at herself. She wants to look at something different. Honestly? Yeah, uh, yeah. Where, where's my blonde? Where's my blonde? Huh? Where are they? Where are they? Every every brunette needs a blonde, and and since I don't have one, I took it into my own hands, and I dyed half my hair blonde. <laughs> like, although I didn't dye it blonde, it's like gray. So like you know, it's fine. It's fine. It's the same. It's same. Whatever. Same idea. Same idea. But today we are playing Genshin Impact gamers. Play y Yuri with Ruby. Bro, bro. I wish Ruby's so cool. I love Ruby. Ruby's really sweet. I was talking to her earlier today. 
But I can't, like, I, guys, I can't, like, listen, I can't play Yuri. I can't flirt at all. I, I, I'm i not a flirter. I, I, I make friends. And Vanna, thank you for gifting five subs. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Um, um, and thank you earlier, uh, Kent, for gifting five subs. And thank you, uh, Joseph, for the resub. And Kent, thank you for the resub as well earlier. Thank you, guys. Thank you. I appreciate you guys. Thank you. Uh, we are currently uh, in actual September now, where all subs are 25% off. Just saying. Just saying. If you guys, you know, if you, if you want to help a girly pop out, um, if you advance in three months, three months advance, it would help your girl out a lot. But, but nonetheless, it doesn't matter. Just, you, just, you, just you being here is more than enough. But, um, I'm not good at flirting. I'm not. I'm really bad at it. Like, I'm genuinely, like, not good at flirting. Like, to the point, like, it makes me, like, want to visibly throw up if I feel like someone is flirting with me. Mira, thank you for continuing the gift sub that you got from Pugsy. Thank you. I appreciate that. Like, it makes me, like, actually want to throw up if, like, someone's flirting with me. I can practice with a VN. That's a great idea. We should just watch VNs and, yeah. Has anyone ever mistaken you for, like, an, a an East Asian? No. No. Never. But, but, I, I, what was I going to say? What was I talking about? Oh, yeah. So, like, but once I've already established that someone's a friend, I can, there's no longer, like, no longer can, can, can I, can I see them in another light? So, like, I don't, it doesn't matter, like, how attractive I find someone. Like, if they are in the friend category, they are forever a friend. They are never, it is never, like, that's it. That's it. And, like, I'm pretty quick to just have people be friends. And so, like, Yeah. Listen, dating is gross. <laughs> <I'll>, <laughs> that's gross. Oh no, I'm like that too. I think a lot of people are. I don't know. But it doesn't matter because today we are playing some Genshin of Impacts. Four point hey, who's played this? Is it good? <laughs> Has anyone I I actually I've not seen any spoilers. Oh, I need Navi on my team. Um I have surprisingly not seen any spoilers, so I'm going into this fully blind. Is it as good as 4.0? Is it is it as good as 4.0? Scenery is wonderful. Kazuo, shut up. Surely enough to convince anyone to become a one. It starts a little slow. Second part, yes. You don't think it was as good as 4.0? Okay, I feel like the 4. Point, like the O patches have to be like the banger, you know, the bangest of the bangs. They got to bang the hardest, as one would say. All right, let me like get rid of all these notifications. We're not pulling. Wow, I have more than 6 primo gems, you guys. I logged on and there was maintenance rewards. I was like, oh my god, oh my god, my we're almost at a full 10 pull, and that one 10 pull is all we need to see six Navia, man. That's all we need. All we need to see six Navia. It, we just one 10 pull, we're gonna get seven of her. Just like right all like all seven is just gonna be Navia. It's gonna be crazy. After watching your stream, you still haven't done the 4.0 arc on quest. I mean, you could just you could just experience it here. You don't you don't you don't need to go anywhere else. What is all of this? What is what, what? What are these? Okay. Um. Uh. What is this? Oh my god! I got a little guy. I just replaced. Oh! Is this for the anniversary? Oh my god! He's so cute. Is that the itty bitty octopus? Is that the itty bitty octo baby? Oh! It's an itty bitty. He's so cute. It's a little... Once, oh my god, shut up. I swear, this thing shows up every time I open the game. Why is it always a new battle pass? I swear Star Wheel doesn't doesn't have battle passes this often. Okay. Um, that's a lot of notifications. What is this? What is this? What is this? Do I have anything for free here? Okay. Alright, 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 alright. And then we will... Um, Oriri, thank you so much for, for continuing the gift sub that you got. Thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you. All right. I can't get over how her tail looks down there. Okay. Uh, 4.1 story quest. Should I do... Oh, wait. Okay, guys. Question, question, question. Um, did anyone have any dreams about what, what potentially dream Navia's boss would be? Did anyone have a dream about this? Did anyone have dreams about like what relic domain she is? Or did anyone have any dreams about like her boss domain or her talent domains? Do you do you guys have any dreams? Like, was there any did anyone like have like a premonition in their dream or whatnot? No. No, it's not. You got you got 
no dreams about Navia yet? You guys, come on. Come on, you guys. It's your job to be having these kinds of dreams. Dreams, my premonitions have not hit. So we don't know, like, what kind of relic she's gonna need. We don't know, like, you guys know dreams about, like, what she's gonna scale off of, what weapon I should be trying to you know, think about. The Dream Master hasn't given them to us. Absolutely useless. Why else do I keep you guys around here if you're not gonna be... If you're not gonna be giving me my dreams on command. A fateful offering. Only Farina dreams? I don't need Farina dreams. I need Navia dreams. Okay, I'm gonna go get this waypoint at least. You dream that she has a claymore. Bro, we saw she had a claymore in the trailer. Time to go. Four piece tenacity uh, scales off of flat attack. Obviously, she is. She is a. She's going to be Geo. She is not scaling off of attack. I dream she. I dream she was Geo. Okay. Wow. You guys are so helpful. I appreciate you all so much. Ooh, what are all these? Wow. Look at us just pick. Wow, guys. I'm role playing as a Genshin Impact player. Is this not crazy? I dreamed that her name was Navi. <laughs> Oh my god, you guys. Look. Look at this. Where's... Hello? Where is it? Where... Where's... Where's the thing? Hello? I'm here. Into the wind. Where's... Where is it? Where is it? Is there a lower part? You dreamed that Navia and Chlorin had a lover's spat? Bro. I was there for it. It was traumatic. I missed them. Dude, is... Um... Hey, is Navia in this... Is, is Navia here? Is Navia at 4.1? Do we, do we, you saw E5 yawning, time out, time out, time out, time out, Thor. Um, is not, does Navia show up in 4.1? No. N not at all, zero? She she was the main character last time. Where did she go? Where not not Navia? Babes, babes. Wait, 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 where did you go? Wait, uh, wait, wait. Wait, where did you where did where did you go, Navia? Navia, you were She's resting after her huge moment. I didn't give her permission to rest. Talk to Catherine. Why do I need to talk to Catherine? Where am I? Well, should we just should we just start? Should I do my dailies? Uh, let's see. Uh, wow, that's a lot of tutorials. Um, there's a new daily system. Commissions. Okay, what is this? Okay. Okay, so these are like normal commissions. But then there's like a point struck. What? Wait, I'm so confused. Okay, 40, 50, 70, only 70. I thought we got I thought we got 90. You get points from the Archon quest? Okay, so we'll we'll get it today with the Archon quest. Click the question mark. What question mark? What question? There is no question. Oh. Ah, encounter points. Uh, Archon quest, story quest, world quest, invitation. Okay, whatever. Um, They're moving in a step in the right direction. I'll give them that much. Good for them. Good for them. They're changing up the structure a little bit. We can never fault them for that. All right, let's go over here. Let's start the world. Let's start. Let's start Fontaine part two. Or I guess point one. Fontaine point one. Um... Do we see Risley? I feel like I've seen nothing about Risley. And that kind of surprises me since he was really prominent in the trailer. We're literally in the Spina du Rasulo whatever area and you're telling me Navia's not here? Where's Catherine? Where are you? Where are you, Catherine? Catherine? Uh, uh, Catherine, where, 
Wait, I don't need to talk to Catherine. Hold on. I don't need to talk to Catherine. I need to go over here. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I'm I'm map impaired. Okay. We're at Navia's house. It's real, and it's empty and waiting for us, as promised. Ah, Navia is such a good person. I know, right? Right, Paimon? Navia is such a good person. Hmm. Now that the serial disappearances case has been solved, no one's going to come after us for anything. Why does Paimon sound different? Even without Silver standing guard, am I just completely relaxed. Am I going crazy, or does Navia sound different? Uh, <laughs> does Paimon sound different? Why don't we stay and rest up here for a while? Even machines of Fontaine need to stop and recharge now and then. The Echo? Uh, if we wanted to rest, couldn't we pick somewhere with a decent view? Oh, come on! This place isn't that bad. This place but isn't I that bad. We get to stay in an actual base. The truth, oh, Paimon. Fine, fine. Remember that detective story Paimon read before? Well, the author is about to release a new book, so Paimon wanted to buy it as soon as it came out and have a quiet place to read it. Just don't spoil the ending for me this time. <laughs> then it's agreed. Come on, let's get some sleep. We'll need to be up first thing in the morning to get in line and buy a copy. You finish the Arkham Quest and you'll have the same thing the entire time. Yeah, her voice feels really different here for some reason. <gasps> this is A. Thank you so much for the Prime Sub Gamer. You only get one of those a month, and thank you so freaking much for using it on me. Thank you. I appreciate that. All right, so, oh yeah, what happened last time? Um, we solved the case of the disappearing woman. It was Marcel, uh, um, Navia's dad was framed. We got his innocence. Corin and Navia went out to lunch together to start rep uh, to, to reconciling their broken relationship, and now they're sleeping together. Uh, what else happened? We found out that Nervulet, um, is, is hiding some stuff from us. And and that and that he he was sad about Callus, and then and then he went to her 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 dad or Navia's dad's grave to like you know like just like you know pay his respects. Uh, and then yeah, Marcel got drowned by scorned woman as he deserved. Uh, what else happened? Uh, Linny and Lynette were missing in action after uh the part Act One. Excuse me. It's Adora. Do you know if the Traveler and Paimon are lodging here? Uh, I don't know who that is. I don't know who the Traveler or Paimon is. Huh? Who are you? Paimon doesn't recall seeing you before. Wait, you're not here to give us trouble, are you? A blonde Traveler and a chatty little fairy. <laughs> <laughs> chatty <laughs> little like fairy. Good thing I asked the Spina di Rosula. Seems they sent me the right way. It's like, okay, they're mentioning Spina di Rasula, but they're not showing me Spina di Rasula. Hey, what do you mean by chatty? Paimon's always careful not to talk too much. Most of the time, anyway. I? This... This sounds like more of a lie than when Dawei said that Honkai Impact was a happy and wholesome story. This, this is as big of a lie as Mr. Dawe. Bro, this is, what even? It's an honor to meet you both. I was sent from the Palais Mermonia. Monsieur Nourilette wishes to see you. It seems he has something important to discuss in person. Nourilette? Nourilette? to see us again already? Nourilette? Huh. I like saying his name. So much the last time we met, has something happened since then? I am not privy to the details. It would be best if I you came up the Palais Marmonia and asked Monsieur Nervillette in person. Bum, bum. If you say so, but... Hyman has a bad feeling about this. Hello, I haven't seen you in a week. Where were you on Tuesday? <sighs> now that I've delivered the message, I'll take my leave. Her voice sounds familiar. The room for a few days, so we'll head over once we fresh it up a bit. They haven't left the room in a few days, bro. Uh, what is happening with this dog? Um, uh, hey, 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 oh, okay, bro. Why, bro, this dog's a little much. 
Am I pulling for Nouvellet? No. Unfortunately, I am skipping his banner. Um, I as cool as he looks, he does look very cool. Um, I I don't need him. Um, I'm not gonna build him. I'm I, I don't want him. I want Navia. Everything <clears throat> everything is for Navia. Everything for Navia, man. This is the most lifelike dog I've seen in this game. Oh my god. He's OP. I don't care. You know who's OP in my heart? Navia. We're, we're, we're saving everything for her. So I, I can't pull on a random man's banner when when I know that my sweet baby angel Navia is like but, but a touch away. She's gonna force herself to like Geo just for Hey, no, i I have a I have Geo supports ready. Okay? Albedo's ready. Um, um, uh, Goro's, like, half ready. I, uh, 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 Noelle's ready, too. She's there. She, she's, she's, she's there. Um, who else, who else is a Geo support? Uh, uh, that's it. That's all you need. You just need, you just need four Geos in a dream. Y y Yunjin? Oh, I should, okay. Okay, okay. The thing about Yunjin, um, okay, the thing... The thing about Yunjin, Yunjin, um, I don't like her world boss. I don't, I don't like her world boss. So I've avoided building her because I don't want to fight the stupid wolves. I don't want to do it. So I, I've simply never built her. Uh, and then for Zhongli, I have no excuse. I simply left him at level six and I called it a day. And before Navi is the first character to function with mixed elements, God, I hope. If somehow they make they make Geo work with Animo just for Navia, I'm set. The wolf is easy with Noel, and that's why Noel is level 80 out of 90. Alright? That's why that's why she's up there. How the heck? I, why do you need shields if you have a healer? Why would you need shields when you have healer? Okay? You don't- you just- just don't get hit! Because interruption? Um, listen man. Yeah, just don't- just hit them harder than they hit you. It's that easy. Wrong door? Okay, understandable. Have a nice day. Oh, it's the open door. That makes sense. He has way too many vowels in his name. I, 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 is that just Ian? It, it, is his name just pronounced Ian? But that's just standard procedure. Oh, he talks like an anime protag. But that's just standard procedure. Dun, dun, dun. All right, let's see. It's like the nervulet. Bum, 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 bum. Hello, Monsieur. Monsieur Nouvelle. Why is Kafka jealous? You daydreaming or thinking something over? Kafka should be jealous of how much I love Navia, though. Yes, I did send someone to fetch you. But as for what I'd like to discuss next... You say this quest has really good moments, but it was kind of boring in the middle. Okay, okay. He's very pretty, though. I will give him that much. You've already made the trip here. You should just tell us that you need us to help you with something, right? Man, they need to invest in phones in this universe. I do indeed have something I'd like to ask you to do. However, you should wait until after I tell you the details, then decide for yourselves. The auto mode and relax. These are the chatty people. Is this. A while earlier at Palace. It has come to my attention then, that the Snezhnayan Harbinger Ooh, has Farina. I love Farina. wants a diplomatic meeting with you, correct? I heard that she was originally from Fontaine, but for her to suddenly arrive here and abruptly request such a meeting like so this... So you love Navi more than Kafka? Yes. I sincerely yes. advise you to I really like Farina. Outright. Hmm. I'm sure you're aware that her purpose is most likely related to Child's recent predicament. We convicted one of the Snezhnayan Harbingers in a court of law, but we have yet to provide any form of detailed report on the matter. 
Yeah. This does indeed provide an opportunity for Snezhnaya to put pressure on us. I can't wait I to go to Snezhnaya. I an evasive stance until we can provide a proper explanation. Do you guys, a um... plan on how to deal with the matter. Um, do you guys ever think about what's gonna happen to Genshin Impact once we go to the last region? So, like, what? There's seven regions. Because there's seven Archons, or whatever. And, um... Right now, we're on region five. So there's Natlin and there's uh, there's Snezhnaya left, correct? What happens when we finish um, with with Teyvat? You get picked up by the Astral Express. We're going to explore Con... Oh, yeah, there is also Conria. Okay, so that's three years. So what happens in four years? What, 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 what's what's, what's going to happen in four years? You know what would be wild, you guys? You know what would be wild is if okay we get Genshin in part two or whatever, but 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 you you're the last scene you're in the last scene of Genshin Impact, all of a sudden, all of a sudden, everything fades to black, and you hear Kiana's voice, and it's like calling out to the traveler, and then and then the game just ends. Teva is only a continent? Bruh. Hey, you. You're finally awake. I would... If Genshin ended with everything being a dream, I'm gonna, like, request a refund. If everything ends up being a stupid dream, if we just find out this was all just a dream sequence, no, no, no. I'm charging back every single payment I ever made in this game if they end up doing that. <laughs> like, that is unacceptable. No. We shouldn't. I think we should agree to the meeting. Oh? Well, you see, we are the ones that owe an explanation. If we keep putting up... She's so meeting, stressed, Ella Farina. ...the result in the problem escalating, right? It's like... Like a fight between two friends. If they don't agree to see each other and talk in person... Isn't it possible that the friendship could end She sounds so time? worried! Though diplomatic relations between Fontaine and Snezhnaya could be considered as friendly, it is only superficially so. You wouldn't go so far <laughs> as to say that our nations are friends, as you did in your example. I like how they're... It was just an analogy. An analogy, okay? I do enjoy how right now they're showing the dichotomy between how Farina acts in public and how she acts in private. I think this is um this is very important for her character, like for understanding her character and her character's motivations. Since Frina is a performer at the end of the day, so she knows how to work a crowd. And she's multidimensional. She knows how to work a crowd. So when she's around her people, she wants to give them the semblance of like everything's fine, everything's okay, she has everything under control. So she puts on that performance for everyone. But then obviously behind closed doors, she's not gonna be that like carefree or she's not gonna be that like you know, like, I don't know what the right word to describe it is, but she's going to be a lot more, like, serious and a lot more realistic behind closed doors. And I'm glad that they're showing us this as well, versus them just telling us in, like, the end of the uh, the chapter. Moreover, even if we were to talk in person, if we don't have sufficient information prepared, it is quite possible the result wouldn't be restored relations, but a complete falling out. Uh-oh. Hmm. I don't think we should overthink those possibilities yet. Ahem. Even if the logic of the divine is not immediately apparent, its wisdom will only be revealed with time. Besides, you'll be at the meeting. <laughs> if any problems do pop up, you'll have no problem navigating them. Bro, she has so much faith in Nervinette. That's actually really cute. I actually, I think that's really cute how much she relies on him. Um... Is I feel like this is like the first region where the Archon has such a like prominent secondhand man. Like in the sense that like she really relies on Nervilet. A confinement. Yeah. Cause like um Venti's pretty much by himself. Um uh Zhongli is pretty much by himself. Uh because everyone else like died. Um um, uh, Raiden Shogun was pretty much by herself on her own choice. Yai Miko wanted to be there, and she was, like, in her emo era, so she didn't really let, uh, she didn't really let her, like, get close. 
And that's why, like, yeah, I was doing all that shit just so she could get close to to, to the riding again. And then, like, yeah, everyone just hated Nahida. Even though, I don't think, I don't think Yai counts. Yai might count now, but I don't think Yai counted while we were in Inazuma. Because the entire time, she was trying to get closer to the Shogun again. Because they lost that, they lost that familiarity that they had with one another. But this is, like, the first time we're seeing it, like, take place during the Archon quest. I must clarify that interacting and communicating with people outside of court is not my cup of tea. It seems you think too much of me. But more importantly, when did I agree to join the meeting with you? <laughs> I like that. Thank you. <laughs> you mean you won't come? No, 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 no that, that won't do. I can't go to the meeting alone. You have to accompany me. I must take you with me. <laughs> That, that was really cute. <laughs> that was really cute. Wait, I really enjoyed that. That was adorable. Lady Farina, could there be something else regarding this matter that is being <laughs> kept from me? <laughs> She's like a kid in trouble, bro. No, not at all. <laughs> Look, I am the Hydro Archon of Montaigne. And see, the God of Justice, who when she gets, um... Yeah, okay, Farina. When she gets overwhelmed or it gets backed into a corner, she defaults back into her over her overcompensating performance mode. This is when she's yeah, this is her not in control. Like fully. I love her so much. So I only hope that justice will be served in this matter. Don't overthink it. I'll go find someone to arrange the meeting. <laughs> I, I like this a lot i like this a lot actually i think my favorite type of plots is um character driven plots Though it could <gasps> officially be considered a diplomatic conference i prefer to see our meeting today as an ordinary tea party Oh, oh, I didn't know she was showing up right now. Okay, we're just, we're okay. I assume you see it the oh, same uh, way, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Um. Um. Okay. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. Okay, I'm, I'm sitting up. I'm sitting up, Father. Um, ahem. Hey, Lee, thank you so much for gifting out 10 subs. I do really appreciate that. Thank you so much. If you guys got gifted a sub, please make sure to say thank you to your sub daddy. Appreciate the ad free viewing experience and the emotes. Holy shit, Arlequino. Oh my god. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. The first time I saw Arlequino, I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Not a fan. I was not a fan of Arlequino the first time. But then... I discovered she had a ponytail. And I was like, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yeah, it, I, did, I don't really like short hair. And I thought she had short hair. But then I found out that there was a ponytail behind the short hair. And my like of her skyrocketed. And also, now, now we both have the skunk aesthetic. Yeah, we like blondes. And she's not blonde. All right, all right, all right. Arlequino, the fourth of the eleven Fatui Harbingers. Hmm. Lady Farina. Oh, I would crumble. Do people ship them? Can I, can I, have you guys seen any fan art of Arlequino and Farina? Uh, oh, <laughs> yes, yes, that's right. Just like you said, a tea party. <laughs> I should thank She's you panicky. for providing the pastries. They look delectable. To make this tea party even more lively, I've invited someone else to join us today. I really love Farina's voice actress. I think she did phenomenal. Like, I I, I genuinely really enjoy the, the English performance of Farina. I think she adds a lot of, like, life to the character. It's a pleasure to meet you, Monsieur Nuvillette. I was born in Fontaine, so naturally, there's no need to introduce the nation's revered Eudex to me. 
Or like Hino has a different voice than I was expecting. I thought she was gonna have more of a um I thought I thought she was gonna have more of like Clorin's type of voice, like a little bit deeper, but I actually really like I like this. Hello. The pleasure is also mine. First, I would like to thank the two of you. I'm often away on business outside of Fontaine. Oh my god, her eyes. That the children of the House of the Hearth have been well taken care of. She body. seriously reminds me of Natasha. Like, like, Honkai Impact Natasha, not, not Star Rail Natasha. She, she really gives me Raven vibes. Like, the kind of in a nefarious organization, very questionable morals, but owns an orphanage and takes care of the kids. So, like, is she really all that bad? Uh. Oh. I'm not referring to when my children, Linny and Lynette, oh. were falsely accused by you. <laughs> Please don't misunderstand. Oh! Oh! <laughs> the children of the House of the Hearth are often misunderstood. Perhaps due to the reputation of the Fatui. There's no getting around that. I would crumble, bro. If someone just whispered in my ear, I think I would crumble. All I meant to say is that Fontaine has been stable in recent years. The people are well off and the children lead happy, fulfilled lives. Uh-huh. That is something truly worth cherishing. And no one wishes to disrupt such peace. Now then, I kind of like the vocal direction she's going the in. Child, correct? Well, yes. It appears the ever-busy Udex Nuvillette doesn't wish to waste time with diplomatic pleasantries and hopes that we can get straight to the point of our talk. I mean, yeah. Yes, as you surmised. Understanding child situations. Oh my gosh, she has bags. Me too, queen. Of this trip. I kind of love how they're getting a little bit more creative with the panning. As we are both diplomats from Snezhnaya, as well as Fatui Harbingers, Child and I have always been colleagues. Were anything to happen in Fontaine, each of us would serve as the other's attorney to resolve. She sounds in control because she is. So now, in my capacity as his attorney, Bro, her I nails? That child be turned over to Snezhnaya. We have a responsibility to cooperate with Fontaine. Well, she can claw me any day of the week. The rules governing attorneys only apply before a trial has concluded. Since a verdict has already been rendered, we see the case as settled. I apologize. Hey guys, who's your favorite uh, harbinger? An outright refusal. Very well. I respect all the rules of Fontaine's courts, just as I respect you as Chief Justice. Well, she's like, and I don't respect you. Okay, why don't we back up a step? Oh my god. You don't need to transfer child to us. I only request to enter the fortress of Meripede to see child and confirm his condition. Oh, we're going through a prison break arc, bro. It's not like you couldn't even manage to fulfill oh. a simple request like that. Right, Ms. Oh my- Marina. Oh my god! Oh my god, the gaslighting! Uh, um, about that. <laughs> She's so nervous! Ah, oh, she's- I love Farina. Farina's so cute. Bro, Farina's so cute. The fortress of Meropede has always been completely autonomous. Even we have no authority to interfere there. What is it, Alcatraz? do not suffice as an excuse. However, if you absolutely must confirm the situation of the Harbinger, I have a proposal. Oh? Okay, you guys said that this chapter was a little slow. I'm enjoying this more than my- I'm enjoying this a lot, actually. I like I like character driven plots, and these are all like future playable characters. So I'm more interested. Yes, thank you for your kind advice. I'm well aware of the situation. I also notice that Lady Farina acts a little odd and unnatural whenever I bring up matters related to the knave. Could the knave be threatening? I'm really glad they're saying the word knave because I would I would pronounce it knave. If that were the case, then why wouldn't Lady Farina inform me? And what means could the knave possibly have to twist the arm of an archon? Hmm. So maybe that's not very likely. Even though Farina can act a little weird at times, she's still an archon. 
Yeah, she's still an Archon. In reality, this problem is even more thorny than it appears. According to reports from the Fortress of Meropede, Child recently disappeared under mysterious circumstances. Dis Did he disappear among the sea of butterflies? Illusions of the past? The details are still unclear. We cannot rule out an escape, but there have also been no reports of him outside. Well, he's of the on his prison break era. Raid. Special guards oversee the fortress, and its internal systems are extensive. Is Risley the, the um, characteristics of the surrounding terrain? One of the guards. An escape should not be possible. I suspect that there's something else behind Child's disappearance. I was only willing to share this information with you because you are friends of Child. And it is my duty to see justice done. Justice. So Shiny justice. Yes. I would like you to go to the Fortress of Meropede and investigate Child's disappearance. You heard from others that they're shipping Grizzly and Blue Otter and Nouvellet? Yeah, I've seen a lot of I've seen a lot of ship art of those two. This was my proposal during our meeting with the Nave. Rather than allowing her to intervene, I offered to send someone to find out about Child's situation and report back to her in detail. The Nave did not seem satisfied by my proposal, but she still agreed to go along with it for the time being. Her words were, We will talk more once we have that report. I like how you like kind of went into character with that. So that means we bought ourselves some time. But why do you want us to go? Firstly, you're already acquainted with Child. Your eyes may discern relevant details there that others would miss. And secondly, is the consideration of the unique nature of the Fortress of Meripede. Unique nature? Isn't it just Fontaine's prison? I would not define it so crudely. The Fortress of Meripede is not affiliated with the court system of Fontaine on paper. It has always existed as an autonomous entity. Early in Fontaine's history, criminals were punished with exile, not imprisonment. Even today, so what you're telling me against convicted criminals still include exile, just as before. The fortress of whatever is just Australia? The fortress of Meripede may seem like a prison, but it should in fact be regarded as a gathering place for Bro, exiles. I was talking to uh I was talking to Evie recently. We we're talking about like like our predictions for upcoming uh, Star Rail stuff. And she was like, she couldn't remember the planet name for Penacone because it's like the ex prison. And she's like, it's Australia. And just, it made me laugh. It made me laugh really hard. All we do is dispatch guards to keep watch and help maintain security. But we have no right to get involved with any other matters. Although I do have a personal relationship with the administrator there, neither myself nor the courts have the right to be directly involved with the investigation. No matter how serious the grounds. Oh, it's French. No, it's French. Okay. Australia. Oh, Paimon gets it oh, now. Australia. That's why you need us to conduct our own investigation as a third party, right? Correct. I will arrange false charges against you so that you may secretly investigate inside the fortress. I don't want to go to jail. This will save us a lot of unnecessary trouble. So... Are you too willing to accept my proposal? I, I wish there was a no option. I just want to know what would happen if, if you said no. Yeah, no matter how you look at it, it seems we're the best choice. All right, we hereby accept this difficult task. Uh, we hereby accept this like difficult it. task. French Australia makes me want to throw up. It's my prison arc, you guys. This is what Hoyo did to me after they found out I got 60% off Primo Gems with the Samsung deal. This is what they wanted to do to me. You two have my sincere thanks. This matter is of critical importance to Fontaine's current situation. Also, I hope that both of you can keep this operation a secret. We will rendezvous at the Fortress of Meropede's entrance on Erinaeus once you've prepared yourselves. I will arrange for someone to take you inside. You guys, um, there was a tweet earlier today that I saw, and it was, um, of Clorin's thighs, of, of Clorin's thighs, and, and the caption was, oh, let me find it, and so, and so the caption was, um, Navia's eating good, I see, and it's Clorin's thighs, and so I, I retweeted it on my private account, okay, and, and Numi follows my private account as well. 
And so she sent me the tweet. And she was like, also, you are teeing this. You're no better than a man. And then... And then I was like, read the tweet. Navi is eating good. And she's like, no better than a man. And then I said, my baby's got to get her nutrients. And then she just keyboard smashed. Sounds about right. Yeah, if you ever if you ever want to know what, what what DM between friends are like, that's pretty much just it. Perhaps you could enjoy a good meal and have a nice bath. I'm afraid that living conditions inside the fortress are nothing like those on the outside world. How long? Wait, how long are we supposed to be in the jail? Oh right, even though we'll be there on trumped up charges, we'll be in prison for real. Uh, on second thought, is it too late to back out? Yeah. Please can we get wait. like, uh, can we get like Since the fancy prison? Can we get like, like where people go for like tax evasion? Not like an report. actual crime, you know? You will be compensated according to the highest standards permitted to legal staff, regardless of the outcome. Now that's more like it. Thank you for Hi, hydrate. Traveler, let's go eat the best meal we can find. We'll eat so much that we won't need to eat another meal for a whole month. Your treat. <laughs> Are you leaving now? In that case, please take this cake as a token of my personal gratitude. That's the cake that, uh, that, that Ar uh, Arlecchino gave us? Or gave them? Go to Cafe Lu Lucen. Yeah, he regifted it, bruh. Where is this cat? Hello? Where am I going? Cake? Alright, well... Geronimo! We're gonna drop first because they always like auto play a scene and then Kazu ends up dying. I'll have that and that. Oh, and one of those two. They're really getting fun with these like with these shots. That cake was pretty good. But as soon as my mom remembered that we're about to go to prison, Paimon's stomach suddenly became completely empty. Bruh. Now that Paimon thinks about it. We've always been super careful ever since we arrived in Fontaine. Just to avoid breaking any strange laws. Uh, I, feel, I feel like Starrell hasn't done this. But here we are, about to willingly send ourselves off to the Fortress of Meropede. Hmm, maybe this is what they call fate. <sighs> Let's just try our best to investigate everything quickly once we get there. Paimon doesn't want to stay in prison too long. Oh, Charlotte? What is that? Here? <laughs> know, where did she story? show up? How did she pop up like that? Hey, you can't hear a taste. And what are you doing here, Charlotte? Oh, don't remind me. I invited an eyewitness to a case to eat here, and I was planning to get some great material out of him, but he didn't even show up. Oh, that sucks. Oh, calm down, calm down. This is nothing new. As a journalist, you should be used to this by now. As long as you can score some juicy tidbits from the traveler, you might still be able to recover the cost of the meal. Girl, girl you're talking out loud. Uh, you know we can still hear you. The you man know? looks so done. She looks so done. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, never mind. It's nothing. I just heard you mention the Fortress of Meripede. You didn't commit a crime, did you? Please tell me all about it. <laughs> I chew. Um. To. Oh no! Paimon almost forgot that Nevelet told us to keep it a secret. We're going to serve our sentences and redeem ourselves. Uh, for spoiling the ending of a detective novel huh? in public. You're being arrested for that? Yeah, it's crazy. Oh, but now that I 
think about it, I suppose that's not completely unreasonable. That's pretty despicable. Almost as offensive as committing theft. Yeah, yeah. Spoiler, people? Yeah, yeah. This is for you guys. Uh, you mean Paimon really did something that serious? See, I told you, Paimon. Sorry, Paimon really messed up. Uh, in that case, it's nothing particularly newsworthy after all. Oh, how disappointing. Bruh. Oh, how disappointing. Oh, right. There's still a chance. Uh, since you're going to be at the Fortress of Miripede, would you be willing to help me gather some material for a story? No. Um, about that, uh, Paimon doesn't think we'll have any time. Yeah, all we have is oregano. Bottom. Bottom. Come on, come on, come on. That's a good one. That's a good one. No, it's nothing difficult. All you have to do is think of a way to get some time face to face with the warden of the fortress. He was awarded the honorary title of Duke in Fontaine. Thank you, thank you guys, thank you, thank you. Only those who have made significant contributions to the nation have been conferred this title. It's incredibly rare. The Duke? On top of that, the Fortress of Meripede has never been under the jurisdiction of the courts. Practically nobody, including journalists like me, knows anything about the person in charge there. That's kind of sus that the entire, like, prison structure is not regulated. If I could write an exclusive article about him, I bet it would sell a boatload of papers. You make it sound easy, but it really depends. Doesn't Mona work for whatever, uh, wherever Charlotte works for? Of course. I wouldn't ask you to do it for free. So this meal is on me. Wow, thank you, a meal. All right, you got a deal. We'll do anything you yeah, want. Yeah, the steam bird. <laughs> then it's settled. The food should be here any second, right? Oh, thank you for stretch. Huh? Ugh. Just how much did you order? <laughs> Your poor wallet. I got like I got so much more, oh, man. You you regret it. I do uh, miss jumping though. Wait. Why is the music so loud here? I had no idea you could eat so much. That didn't go according to plan. Please, please, don't forget about the material for my news article. Oh yeah, we can't talk about dreams, you guys. Time to go. Time to go. Opera Epicles. They haven't upped the resin yet in Genshin. That's wild. I thought they would have upped it already by now. Oh no, they're all dying. Ah uh, yeah, got some chicken. I, Fischl, the princess in Defer Ertalong, deserves to take the stage over that imposter Archon, Lady Farina. I love Fischl, man. Fischl's also best girl. I adore Fischl. Guys, remember when Navia sat on that bench? Wait, am I not supposed to... Was I not supposed to come in here? You love the most obnoxious character. I like the most fun characters. She knows how to have a good time. She's so cute. Ah, there it is. Wow, wowie. That is... That that's very big. That looks like a freaking guillotine, man. Burn, burn, burn. I feel like there should be guardrails. You could you could fall off. I think that would hurt a lot. 
can make a full video of how many times she met. I didn't even mention Navia. That's not like official. All right, Novelek, we're ready. Is this where the entrance is? You have come just as promised. Yes, this is the one and only entrance to the fortress of Meripede from Erinaeus. Ooh. Careful, you may want to step back a bit. Ooh, so you have to go down from here? Is the prison Oh, I talked about how she was sitting on the cat. Well, she was. Utilizing both the barrier of the water as well as the fear humans have of the depths, the fortress of Meripede is naturally the perfect place to confine and guard criminals. But do not worry. It is not nearly as frightening Call of Duty is way better than Genshin Impact. Bro, you're so cringe. Bro, that's so cringe. Uh, Paimon hopes you're right. Don't know about you, but just thinking about being at the bottom of the um, sea actually, like that, streamer, uh, uh, have you ever heard of this really cool underground game called Call of Duty? It's so much better than that stupid little gacha game you're playing. Oh my god, that's why I just I have the incessant need to go on Twitch.tv and, and click on a Genshin streamer just so they know, just so they know that that Call of Duty is just such a better game than than this weeb shit. Okay, and oh, and there's one more thing. I mentioned that I have had personal dealings with. The <laughs> have you heard of this small of indie game Rise called League of Legends? <laughs> He's a very shrewd fellow. <laughs> Literally, who asked? <laughs> Risley. Oh, He's that Duke, right? How are you going to call yourself Call of Duty pro player? It's called overcompensation, isn't it? Correct. He is the highest ranking manager of the underwater prison. Even though you are going there to investigate at my behest, it would behoove you to avoid any confrontation with him or any of his subordinates. The Duke rarely ever leaves the fortress of Meripede. But that does not mean he is not privy to all that is happening inside and outside the fortress. He is quiet, but not unaware. So please bear that in mind. Wow, you're very, uh, you're very astute to him, Nervulet. All right, that's about all the time that we have to talk privately. I'm counting on you two. Okay. Don't worry, we won't let you down. We won't let you down. Good. <clears throat> Good. Madeline. I'm here. Monsieur Nervillette, these two are the newest convicts, I presume. <laughs> Don't worry, they won't escape on my watch. Did she not just notice how gently we were talking to each other, like not convicts? <laughs> like we would try. Please follow me, you two. I'll process your paperwork for entering the fortress of Meripede. Meripede. Oh, what is this? To continue. Uh I created another universe and found Huh? Earth. This is new. I, Fischl, and the princess and Duffer er You can actually not get blocked from other quests, apparently. Oh my god, are we ready to go to jail, you guys? A new system that warns you some characters will be unavailable for other quests. Oh, so it's not like you can release them? Okay, it's a step in the right direction. At least now we can't say like, oh, you didn't tell us. I'm so sorry. I did the crime and now I must do the time. It's just my, my ass was too fat, you guys. I, I just, I couldn't. That's, that's, that's why I, I'm going to jail. So this is what it feels like to be a criminal in Fontaine. You two seem to be taking this pretty well. It's rare to see convicts in such a good mood. Man, I love jail. Is there any chest here? Ah, uh, whoops. Sorry, I just wanted to go take a little swim, you know? But she's just going to Chuni jail for being cringe. I love that for her, my baby angel. Cause you were my angel. Who are you? All right. 
Uh, I feel like my ad structure got changed. Because it used to be once an hour, and now I feel like it's one minute ads three times an hour. Even though I changed it. I don't get it. I created another universe. Who's my most hyped <sighs> character for the ones getting teased? Uh, Hanya. It's you, Madeline. Why'd they make you make the trip down here today? Monsieur Nervalet personally requested I escort these two convicts. I suppose he was concerned others might not be up to the task. Girl, it's not that deep. <laughs> well, now, aren't you the lucky one? Must be nice Do to they be have on good terms with the big shots like the Chief Justice. The only people I get to see every day are the new inmates. Oh my god, oh my god, do they have beef? Well, have you tried service with a smile? Who knows, it might help your professional reputation. <laughs> yeah, right. As if. Every criminal comes through here looking miserable. How can I smile with such a toxic work environment? Oh my god. And even if I did smile at them, the convicts would probably just think that I'm some freak getting some kind of twisted enjoyment from their pain. I mean... Oh, she's got a point. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that's kind of funny. <laughs> well, I finished transferring you. You two will register I hate that Paimon made me laugh. guide you through the remaining procedures. <sighs> yep, I'll take it from here. You head on back to that bright and sunny world above. Oh my god, she's just depressed. Okay, let me see. You are the Traveler and Paimon, correct? Present. That would be us. Let me confirm your charges and sentence. I go for, like we're not in chain uh, handcuffs. See. You two are charged with eating a cake specially prepared for the Archon by a Snezhnayan envoy without the Archon's permission, thereby incapacitating the political center of Fontaine for a brief period. Sentence... 45 days? Our... Our... Our punishment... is for eating a cake? He gave us a cake to set us up? Huh? Let them eat cake! Wait, you mean the cake that Nervala gave us was... Just looking at the charges, it seems you two are capable of causing some serious trouble. Well, that better be sarcasm. And considering how fond Lady Furina is of sweets, this crime is tantamount to trying to assassinate the Hydro Archon herself. W you flatter us. Now I've seen everything. <laughs> anyway, we still need to finish processing now you I've before seen you can everything. enter the fortress of Meripede. Please stand in front of the board over there. I hope like after I'll we leave, shots with my she camera. just starts laughing, and then she like goes to like the other guys. Like you hear about those two schlumps. Oh, all right, but be sure to catch Paimon's good side. I don't think it's Kafka's VA. Smile, Lumen. Oh my god, we're going to jail. It's like the Barbie meme. They don't have, like, prison uniforms or anything. And we're done. Thank you for your cooperation. Next, someone will be along to guide you inside the fortress. Please be sure to cherish this opportunity for rebirth. Huh? Huh? Rebirth? rebirth? Isn't that a little much? What rebirth? We're gonna be here for 45 days. Yeah, wait, 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 wait. What rebirth? Hello, Code. How, are, how are you? Inmates, right? Follow me. Follow me. Save it. Not like I'll remember your names. This guy Move seriously it. looks like that one actor from that one movie. Uh, what's it called again? 
Guys, I've said it before. What, what's, what's the movie called? Uh, oh, oh, it, uh. No, no, you guys, no, 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 you guys know what, you know, you know who I'm talking about. Um, no, what's his name? Oh, what's his name? No, it's that one movie where, um, it's, it's the guy. We're the Millers! Thank you so much. It's the guy from We're the Millers. Oh my god, the way that you knew what I was talking about. I'll, I'll get a picture for you guys. Don't worry, don't worry, I got you. He looks like Will Will po Poulter, like but like the kid version of Will Poulter. Where's the kid version of him? I don't need I don't need the new him. Uh, let me see. Uh, um, Will uh da, 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 da. this guy. He, okay, okay. You telling me that's not the same person? You telling me this isn't the same person? Th they look the same, come on. They look the, they look the same. Like, the eyebrows, and like, I don't know, it, it's giving me the same vibes. I could have used a better side-by-side, -side, okay? But, you know, it's whatever. They both definitely have faces. That, that they do. Faces, indeed. I'm on a boat. Let's have a party. All right, where's Riz? Ooh. So, are you one of the guards here? Um, is there anything we should be careful of while we're here? Kren, thank you for wasting 5,000 channel points on absolutely nothing, you pathetic piece of shit. Literally wasting all those channel points on garbage. Are you not ashamed of yourself for being a literal piece of shit? You are nothing, you are pathetic, you are a literal freaking degenerate. Can you open your mouth? Open it nice and wide. Are you ready? You have to go. Ah. Ah. Uh, Pathetic. Close your mouths, you little shits. Uh, did Paimon already ask something she wasn't supposed to? Why should I tell you anything? Oh. What's in it for me? Oh? You sure don't seem like a guard. This is exactly why I can't stand you fish. I wouldn't even be doing this if it weren't for the credit coupons. Credit coupons? You're couponing? Coupons. Is he couponing? All right, seeing as you're not the annoying kind that's getting dragged in here crying and blubbering, I guess I can tell you a few things. The next time, it'll cost you some coupons. Mora means nothing here. Here, we use credit coupons. Okay, you've said it like 12 times. Coupons can get you almost anything in the Fortress of Meripede. Desires? Fulfilled. You want power? No problem. This music? Coupons can even change fate itself. So, credit coupons are a currency that can only be used here? It's not as simple as that. Like Moret said, everyone gets a chance at rebirth. What? No matter how much money or power you had before, it means nothing once you set foot inside the Fortress of Meripede. So it's Australia. You have to start over and earn your coupons. Everyone starts from the same place. And you have a chance at a new, less terrible life. I guess that's the real purpose of the coupons. They symbolize so it's just a true different fairness and true payment justice. structure. And this is also exactly why so many criminals choose not to return to the outside world 
even after they've served their sentence. Oh. oh. So that's what the fortress of Maripede is like. Huh. Paimon was under the impression Bro, they're all just obsessed with, like, gotcha. They're just collecting coupons. It certainly ain't all sunshine and roses here. But it's also not the worst place to be. You'd better take a good look at the scenery now. It'll be the last chance you get for a while. Oh. After being away from the sunlight for so long, even the terrifying depths of the sea start to feel like home. It just stops feeling oppressive, you know? Oh, I'm actually an inmate like you two. Welcoming newcomers is a job I've picked up to earn some extra coupons. Have you seen the Duke? Have you seen a harbinger from Shneznaya? Okay. Uh, why aren't you answering us again? I've told you enough for free. Any more info is gonna cost you. Oh my god, that's so annoying. You Thank you for hydrate. Flora. Wait, no. Coupons? Almost there. It's down through here. Your turn to give it a try. Give what a try? Oh, it's water. Okay. Hey, do you guys know water is wet? Wow. If I go on the boat. Huh. What if you just like... <laughs> Escape on the boat. There's no chest here? Oh, wait, there's a there's a thingy over over there. Wait, how do I get it? Wait, 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 where is it? How do I How do I get it? Wait, 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 wait. How do I get the uh how do I get this? How do I get over there? Oh, is it above ground? That's BS. <laughs> Teleport out, but we're in jail. We can't just leave. It's fine. We're being realistic about being in jail. We won't know the map. It's my job now. I'm the bookie. Where am I going? Ride the lift. Where's the lift? Oh, there's the lift. Okay. Alright, let's go. This music is really good. Is it really worth it for me to go unlock? I'm just leaving prison. Well, that was easy. <laughs> wow. Is this what it feels like to be a free man after serving 20 minutes in jail? Well, I'm never going back. Now that I've tasted freedom, they're never going to catch me again. Wow, it's so beautiful here. Freedom, hell yeah, brother. Oh, look at those birdies. How cute. <laughs> All right, and now we can go here. Uh... What? Oh 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, oh my god. Okay, okay. Oh my, if we had to walk to jail, I would have been so upset. Oh my god, I would have switched games if we had to walk to prison. <laughs> Alright, now we can see jail. Alright. Alright, 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 alright. Let's go down. Of course I'm scared. I've never been to jail before. I'm a goody two-shoes. And I've done nothing to go to jail. Wow. Sus. Hello, Numi. Thank you so much for the tier one for 22 months. Thank you. Bro, I almost got like... I almost had to make a walk of shame back to this area. <laughs> May the glory of the princessin... You've so seen the driving video? Even deeper now? Damn, Paimon just but shut official up. I can drive. It's like a metaphor for your previous life, isn't it? Bro, we're here for 45 days. What do you mean previous our life? Lives weren't that bad. Going to jail for simping? Nah, that's you guys. I've never been a simp a day in my life. I've also never lied a day in my life. What crime would I be arrested for? I don't know, tax evasion. I, I that's a joke. That's a joke. I pay my taxes. I I pay my taxes. Ooh, ooh, we've been a bad, bad girl. Ooh. Wow. So this is the actual entrance to the fortress of Meribede? Did Daddy come huh. home yet? I'm it not pulling like for him. Other new arrivals too. I'm free to play. Oh, they sure don't look happy. Uh, maybe we look. Too relaxed for fresh convicts. Hurry, think of something sad. Oh, right. We're on someone else's territory now. No, 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 no. Uh, I'm free to play, free to I play. I need to think of a good way to act like criminals to get by. No, he's about if to get introduced, to me. Even Nervelet might not be able to rescue us. Nervelet? If we ever get found out, then maybe we'll become real criminals. Hey. This guy seriously looks like Will uh, Pol Pol look, Polter. I don't really know you, and I have no idea what kind of crime you committed, but you wouldn't have happened to anger someone important, did you? Err, uh, uh, no. Someone important? Hmm, Paimon doesn't think so. No, 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 man, I breathe. Uh, wait, why are you suddenly trying to talk to us now? Did I pull no, for Lenny? No. Worry about that. Anyway, it's over there, so... You just go on over there by yourselves. Wait, I've why? I've done my job, so good luck. Uh, that I didn't. I didn't feel. I don't. I don't feel like you didn't mean that. What was that all about? I, I feel like you didn't mean to say uh, good luck. Wait a second. Are there usually so many garter backs around here? Does that mean they're already on to us? Get ready to fight. Oh. Prisoners numbers seven four five nine and seven five six zero. Welcome. Oh, no need to be anxious. These guard mechs aren't here to attack you. In fact, they're here as your honor guard. When I heard that you were friends of Monsieur and Nervelet, the guard mechs come and wait in formation. Wait, do you know about our connection with Nervelet? Oh my god, I've never seen Numi so the down C4 bad before. Isn't as cut off from the world as He's you very imagine. cute. However, I'm afraid that I know nothing more than that you are friends of the Udex. And, as you can see, committing a crime means being sentenced here. Even if you're friends with the Chief Justice. He sounds more Not happy fair. than I thought. He sounds a lot happier than I thought he was gonna sound. The, the Duke. The, the Duke. Greetings, your grace. L lovely weather today. I love it? his little tie. I, I, oh my god. The way that he, he looks. Genshin's going in the right direction for making a beefy man. Like, slowly but surely, we are getting there. It's his little fake dog ears. Oh, greetings, my good fellow. Good well, I'm willing fellow. to imagine that the weather is as good outside the sea as you say it is. <laughs> ah, how great it would have been if only the fortress of Meripede had been built on the coast, huh? It would have been so convenient Why? to enjoy a nice chat in the sunshine. Why is he so pleasant? I thought he was going to be like an angry dog. I would wait. I was expecting like mad dog. Like he's going to be like, huh, yeah. 
um, don't talk to me. I have the power of two wolves inside of me. But, like, he sounds, like, really pleasant and, like, really nice. I can break him. I'm gonna, um... I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put a pin of shame on, um, I, I think, I think, I think it's only right that we, uh, we do a pin of shame for, for someone who is more down bad than I am. <laughs> God, I like Grizzly though. I think he's cute. Ah, my profuse apologies. I just got so nervous when I saw you. I just. What? You peed your pants? You came? What, what is this? He sure looks a lot younger than Paimon imagined. The traveler and Paimon, correct? Mr. Deacon here was responsible for your welcome. I love his outfit. Trust you were satisfied with his guidance? I really like his outfit. Grizzly, my little princess. It's okay, his attitude could use some work, though. Ah, I see. In that case, I regret to announce that Deacon <gasps> has just missed the best opportunity in his prison career to be promoted. Wait, I'm so sorry. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Wait, does he actually get demoted? Well, you know what? He wasn't being nice to us. He doesn't deserve to be... He doesn't deserve it. Okay, he he it, he doesn't deserve it. I uh, I admit that I was only thinking about the coupons. I'm sorry to have disappointed you, Your Grace. Uh, I originally I once hoped for a chance to do some higher level work. Well, well, maybe if you were nicer to me and answered my questions, I would have given you a positive review. But no, no, you only talk about coupons. You like don't talk to me. Like it's gonna cost you. If you like blah 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 blah. This is the consequences of his own actions. You never know who, who's gonna bite you in the ass. I had no idea you two were big shots who were worthy of speaking with his grace. Losing out on such a big opportunity because I couldn't see past my own nose. Yeah, learn better for next time. Plenty of time ahead, Peasant. Deacon. There'll be more opportunities. Well, I believe that concludes the introduction. Oh my god, his eyes. Yeah. Deacon, if you would. Yes, Your Grace. I'll take my leave now. Please follow me. To make you feel more welcome, I'll oh, show you. Oh, look at his like arms. He actually has muscles. Meripede. I hope it'll help you adjust to life here. He's going to personally give us a cure? Huh. Paimon can't figure out what this guy's thinking at all. Uh, let's just roll with it for now, but I hope he doesn't know too much already. No wonder Charlotte's so interested in him. He's one of those mysterious types. He's mysterious. Right, let's keep up with him. He's like a non-furry version of that guy from ZZZ. Oh my god, you are right. Oh my god. What's the, what's the, what's the butler's name? Uh, the butler in ZZZ. That, that, okay, no, you're actually. Oh my God, you're actually correct. Um, where's actual fan art? I Not do like, worry about the well-being Fischl, shut of my up. retinue during my impromptu absence. Fischl, I'm sure the good people of the adventure Oz, shut up. absolutely fine, main foyline. Uh, von Lyakin. Hold on, here, here for you guys. Right here, right here. I know y'all y'all are furry lakers. Is this not basically a I mean that's basically Risley just like I for, like his fursona. For this this is the second the wolf end. inside Risley. I want Risley so bad. God, meow meow. Okay, it looks like Kalpis. I don't think that looks like Kalpis, man. <laughs> it doesn't sound normal when she reads it out loud. Yeah, you don't say. Where am I going? I mean, this looks like the Spina di Rosula. Just like a little cleaner, actually. 
There's no need to be so reserved. Ooh, he looks the good. Label of criminal is nothing I love the maroon on him. Identities. And being criminally inclined here at the fortress is just one of many ways to survive. I will survive. Uh, is it really okay for the warden to think like that? We're real criminals, you know. Yeah, we ate what cake. If we're too difficult to handle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're we're real. We're real bad guys, you guys. We ate we ate cake. Meant for Farina. Well, then maybe you'll be able to carve out a name and a place for yourselves in this underwater world, hmm? We got SeaWorld? But before you go in swinging... I want to know why he has a little scar here. That in the Fortress of Maripede, it's better to and not his two little earrings. What are all these scars? Or for the guards. He get choked out or something? Like, it looks like claw marks on his neck. Now, we've arrived at a very important place. The Coupon Cafeteria. You can come here and claim one welfare meal each day. Welfare meal? You mean it doesn't cost anything? That's right. Criminals are essential to fortress operations, so we must guarantee that they at least have the basic means to survive. Okay. <laughs> but that's not how it was. Back in the day, it cost your reward coupons just to get a cup of water. Coupon? Here. For fish like you who just arrived with nothing. You have to go to work hungry until you earned enough coupons to eat. Damn. It was only after His Grace became the administrator that we got the free meal rule. Now everyone gets a square meal every day. Even no good slackers who've never picked up a wrench in their whole lives. Nobody starves to death here. Okay, that's nice. In the Fortress of Maripede, credit coupons are the only currency, and everything must be purchased. In some sense, you could say using the coupons is a form of trade. So it's money. You you just made money. But trade is always conducted by people. So if we want trade here to prosper, we need everyone to work hard and live their lives. God, this is what Ito should have been. If nobody could even afford a meal, then the whole fortress would be up in arms. That would only make things more difficult for me. People survive on one meal a day? Yeah. So, rather oh, than mad man, it's a whole thing. a free meal here... You should say that everyone's hard work has improved the living conditions in the Fortress of Maripede. Your Grace's reasoning is correct, but what I said is also true. Whatever the case, hard work is rewarded here. You'd be hard-pressed to find anywhere else as fair and reasonable. Right! Pyron sees your point. By that logic, this place doesn't seem so bad after all! I don't know, man. Oh, wait, no. We should have dropped our guard so quickly. But... It seems the inmates really respect the Duke because of his attitude, right? Hmm. We should still try to verify the truth with our own eyes. Uh, let's continue this way. Bro, I kind of like, I'm shocked at Risley. I really thought he was going to be more like edgy. I'm like, I'm pleasantly surprised that he's not. Like genuinely, genuinely, I'm really pleasantly surprised that he's not edgy. Like it, I like I like that so much more. He's just a he's just a guy. You're glad he's this way. Same with Nervalet. Yeah, same. God, I can't. I don't like edgy boys. So this makes me so happy. Yeah, Arlequino has all the edge. God, I love jumping. Ooh, this fist. place is known as the Pancration Ring. Sometimes we have criminals who have more energy than they know what to do with. Their daily work alone isn't enough of an outlet for them. So, it's Fight instead Club? of leaving them to their own devices, we've provided them with this dedicated venue. It's Fight this Club? Way, nobody will get involved unless they want to be. Pancration matches? And you can earn extra coupons? Oh, what do you think, Traveler? Interesting? But I must warn you that your sentence will be extended if you fail to restrain yourself oh. and end up seriously injuring or killing your opponent. Seems you know me too well. So, did you set this place up too? No, actually. I just granted approval for the organizer to use this area to build the ring, and I oh. collect a portion of the proceeds in return. Of course, the fees are also quite useful. Oh. Proceeds? Do you mind if we ask what they're used for? 
Sure. Ensuring personal safety, maintaining the arena, and resolving any conflicts that arise. Why? Are you interested in how to manage a pancreation ring? What? Is he actually a good leader? Oh, no, no. I was just wondering if that's how you paid for everyone's welfare meals. Is he actually a good freaking leader? A reasonable guess. I see you have a talent for entrepreneurship. Oh, you hear that? Paimon has a talent! So we can start a business here? No. That is something you can discuss between yourselves later. <laughs> Let's move on for now. He said, er, no. I miss Farina. Let's go. Oh. Uh, this area is massive. Are we going into Fight Club? We're going to an Ussy? What is this? X? What's all this? Welcome to the Rag and Bone Shop. Purveyor of oh. all essential provisions. <laughs> Free meal, entertainment, a job. Where do I sign up? Bro, no. Don't go to jail. Don't do it. Don't do it. Uh, pretty face. Boy, you have the same face as every other NPC. What do you mean, pretty face? I'm just such a bad guy. How do I get up there? Hello? Um, I would like to put on the record... I have zero R5 characters. I don't believe in Weapon Banner. And in Genshin Impact, I only have Gen Kazuha as C6. I don't I don't have I don't have any R5 weapon. Until Navia, will she out? I am the boss now. Bro, where the hell is Risley? How do I find him? How do I get up there? Okay, I'm gonna follow this. This will surely lead me the right way. God, this music is so badass. All right. All right. We're going up. I'm yelling timber. Na 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 na. I love official man. Hey man, the map did not help me, okay? <laughs> All right. Talk to Risley at the dormitories. All right. I swear to God, we're not making that hashtag a thing. Uh, your, your grace. Fitzroy? Good morning. I mean, good afternoon. No, wait. What time is it again? Lol. What time indeed. Time waits for no one. It's time so for you to get a watch. To keep an eye on it. Uh, my, my apologies, your grace. <sighs> Jeez. That guy's so nervous, he almost <laughs> forgot to breathe. <sighs> oh my Sorry. god. Forgive my manners. Hold on, guys, I'm gonna get These a drink real quick. These are the which is where inmates sleep. The guards will inform you where your bunk is later. In the fortress of Meripede, criminals usually spend most of their time in either the production zone or the sleeping areas. Production zone. Or the sleeping areas. What does it produce? Is that where we'll be Produces your mom. Them? I'm sorry. Not necessarily. Though working in the production zone is the most reliable way to earn credit coupons. If you have other skills, you can skip your shifts to earn them in other ways. Am I actually free to play? Yeah. Wow. Wait, you're the manager of this place? And you're just telling us to our faces that it's okay to skip work? The fact that the Fortress of Meripede has continued operating completely autonomously 
is proof enough that most people are willing to work honestly and earn a stable income. Wait, yeah, is this just socialism? Many of the clockwork machines seen all over Fontaine originate from our workshop. Therefore, the Fortress of Meripede is not only a place where criminals serve their sentences, but also a giant machine factory. There's no need for me to get into specifics about the production process now. You'll experience it all firsthand when you report for work tomorrow. I don't want to work. Thank you. You got it, boss. <laughs> he's. Let's move on. He's kind of cute. The tour continues over this way. Oh, he's kind of cute. Oh, Linny. <laughs> um. Yeah, me too, Lumen. Me too, Lumen. Why is Linny here? Um. What, 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 uh, why is he, why, I don't understand why, why Lenny would be here. I, I, he, he was, we, we made sure he was innocent. <laughs> oh, uh, you really scared me there. I didn't expect to see you here, uh, your grace. Irk! <laughs> I thought maybe I was so tired from work that I was starting to see things. The only thing you should be seeing is the work in front of you. Stay focused and keep up the pace. Oh? Aww. Is something the matter? Um. Okay, my theory. <laughs> it's game theory time. I'm just worried about how hard we'll have to work tomorrow. <laughs> game theory time. Um, Arlequino sent Linny to jail. So that he can go retrieve child. But Tartaglia is already missing. So now Linny's kind of stuck in prison for, for now. Until until they're able to get out uh, Tartaglia. Is Lynette here? That is the question. I don't think Linny would allow Lynette to go to jail. But yeah, but that's just a theory. A game theory. Uh, you guys are saying that I'm not free to play because I have a C6 Kazuha. And I would like to point out, this is not C6. This is actually C0. And for, I have a visual bug on this account where it shows that it is C6. But in actuality, in actuality, it's, it's just, it's E0. Are you still going to stream the 1.4 special program in the morning? Yes, I will wake up at 6 a.m. for you guys. Oh no, I did okay. I thought it was gonna st I I thought it was gonna stop me. I I I thought it was gonna stop me from jumping off the edge. I I I I, I genuinely thought I don't know. I thought it would. I think I've been playing too much Star Rail. It doesn't let you jump off of anything. God, this music is so badass. <laughs> I'm not a whale. I'm free to play. I'm F2P. Is it a little concerning that there's just weapons lying around everywhere? Oh, this kid. She was in the trailer. Oh, she's cute. I'm gonna punt her. Yes. What are you doing in the infirmary at a time like this? Oh, oh no, you didn't injure yourself, did you? She's cute. Not yet, unfortunately for you. But thank you for your concern, Siege Wing. Oh. <laughs> then you must be here for those two. Why is there a child in prison? Allow me to introduce you. This is the infirmary, and Sijuin here is the fortress of Meripede's head nurse. Why? Why is why? Why they allow a kid in prison? That that feels illegal. I, it, it gives me illegal vibes. <laughs> Hello, new faces. They call me the head nurse, but I actually handle all the nurse-related work all by myself down here. Wow! Good job. Since you seem to have some rare downtime with no patients, perhaps you could find the time to join us for dinner. She's gonna be like nine hundred. <laughs> oh, then these two must be some important convicts. <laughs> sure, 
I'll join the welcome party. Yeah, we're important. Thank you. Your presence will be the pièce de résistance for today's tour. The pièce de résistance? Oh, so the tour part is over now? I believe I've already covered the primary aspects of life here in the fortress. You showed us where As to eat, work, where to fight, to someone else to guide you through the details. and where to heal. Hmm. Is there anything else? I seldom conduct tours, so why don't you just ask if you have any questions? Uh, well, this is our first time here. Paimon's not sure what to ask. Yeah, where's the bathroom? Then let's head back to the coupon cafeteria. Maybe a meal will help you think up some questions. You should at least try to be excited. Our free meals are actually pretty good here. Oh? Are they? Fischl, stop jumping on the bed, Fischl. You're being silly. Five little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Uh... Uh, the mama came around and da, 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 da. no more jumping on the bed. You guys remember that? The mama called the doctor and the doctor said, No more jumping or no more monkeys jumping on the bed. Something like that. Yeah, I did butcher it. Listen, I haven't had to sing a lullaby in a very long time. Bum, bum. Where is the cafeteria? The Oratrice? Wow. What do you think of the food? So what Does happened with the um What happened with the theories about Risley being blind because of the one scene? In the thingy Mababi, in the in the the four in like the four point trailer, where it showed him like with a coffee cup and like her getting like all stressed out. Wow, it looks delicious. No one had made it sound like living conditions in the fortress of Maripede wasn't very good. Who would have guessed that criminals get to eat tasty food like this every day? The main thing is that it's free. Oh, isn't that the meal box that only super lucky people manage to draw? Seems like you two are quite fortunate. Oh? It actually has nothing to do with luck in this case. I had a word with Walsey, so you didn't have to draw lots like everyone else. Why are we getting special treatment? Oh, you mean the meals are random? Yes, what you get to eat depends completely on your luck. You could say that it's a distasteful little game that Chef Walsey likes to play here in the cafeteria. Um, gotcha meals? I would suffer so bad. I I am not. I'm so picky. I'm a it. If criminals got to eat tasty food like this every meal, the crime rate in Fontaine would skyrocket for sure. Well, that's also why they don't know anything. The criminals don't know what life is like down here. Excuse me. Did I hear you mention Nervulet just now? Oh, I've been wondering how he's doing. Is he busy with work? Has he been taking care of his health? He seems healthy no matter how you look at him. But he works so hard all the time, so it must be really tiring. It must be really tiring. Sounds like he hasn't changed a bit. Looks like you can stop worrying so much, Sejuine. I actually, I think she's really cute. I really like her eyes. Oh, that's good. But I still feel like it's been too long since I've heard any news about him. No news is good news. Maybe next time I've got something to discuss with him, I can invite you to accompany us. Hmm? But isn't the Fortress of Meropede independent from Fontaine's court system? Yeah, what do you guys what have, do to you two have to discuss? Well, we provide all kinds so of when does, like, products for efficiency. Okay, I'm having fun and all, but when Some does the plot goods happen? Some have to be obtained from the overworld, so we naturally have to stay in touch about this and that. Monsieur Nivellet's character is unimpeachable. No matter the question, you can discuss it openly and freely with him. Talking with him feels quite effortless. In light of that, I am quite willing to go out of my way to show respect. I mean, I'm enjoying this. I think Grizzly's an interesting character. In fact, right now, I'm treating you two as guests invited by Monsieur Nouvellet. But unfortunately, Monsieur Nouvellet. I can only do so until the end of this meal. 
After this, you two will just be inmates here. Understood. Thank you for your You're hospitality. Well, your new life awaits. How does his jacket staying on? Are you finished eating? Then I recommend that you return to the dormitories and rest. You have work to do tomorrow. What is our work? Perhaps you were hoping to ask for some special privileges? Sorry, you'll have to use credit coupons like everyone else. It's not as comfy here as you might imagine. Not the coupons. I don't want to be a coupon peasant, man. Now that I've gotten a good look at you two, I think you're very cute. Oh my god, thank you. After all, heavy is the head that wears the cutesy crown. <laughs> I what? guess I just want to say, just take care of yourself and don't get hurt. Uh... Why would we get hurt? Why... Why would we... Why would we get hurt? Oh, I don't understand. Lysen, thank you for wasting 5,000 channel points on absolutely nothing, you pathetic piece of shit. Literally wasting all those channel points on garbage. Are you not ashamed of yourself for being a literal piece of shit? I created another you are universe nothing. You are pathetic. You're a literal I, freaking degenerate. Can you open your mouth right now? Open it nice and wide. You ready to go? Ah. Ah. P pathetic. Close your mouths, you little shits. All right, let's let's zoom on over there. There's so many weapons. All right, these are the dorms. Fielding. The traveler and Paimon, right? Fielding Listen these up. nuts. The only thing you need to worry about is his what mustache. to do and when to do it. Don't make any extra trouble for yourself. Your bunks are right over there. Follow me. Your bunks are right over there. Follow me. Honestly, not that bad. <sighs> so this is where we'll be sleeping from now on. Oh, Paimon can't believe this. Oh, the days of staying home and reading detective stories are like a dream now. Uh, they got lost the in the way, sea Sarah, of butterflies. We saw a lot of things worth investigating just now. Yeah, this is a very spacious, uh, like, prison cell. Even though the Duke didn't say it too directly, judging from what he said at the end, it seems that he was only welcoming because we know Nervalette. Good job, Paimon. We are criminals, and Paimon did eat that cake, but we're actually here to help Nervalette. You know what I find really unfair about this sentencing? Only Paimon ate the cake. Why are we here? I just, I just feel like, you know, in the name of justice. Yeah, it, it, it's Paimon's fault. Like, I, why, why are we also in jail? possible that he knows we're here on a mission? Or is Paimon overthinking things? Yeah, Paimon thinks so too. Mina wants to abandon Paimon? Yeah, I do. Here from the very beginning, and like Hutao says, two for one. Message. Damn. Maybe something like, Hey, I have my eyes on you, so don't hey. try anything funny. I have my eyes on you. Why, Ayata? Yeah, you're right. It's not like we can go back to Nervalette But did you attempt to stop Paimon? Say, was I given a choice? Scary, so we gave up. Uh, and besides, the Duke said that he was willing to go out of his way to show respect for Nervalette, right? So, we at least need to try. But Paimon hasn't gotten a clue Is Paimon where voice is more childlike, a stuffy? Kind of, yeah. I definitely think it sounds different right now. You mean... 
Lindy's presence here. Yeah, that's what Paimon was thinking too. Paimon almost spilled the beans when we ran into him. Fortunately, based on his attitude, it looks like the Duke sees Lenny as just another inmate. We were so I wonder if Lynette is here. Lynette I don't think Lenny would allow Lynette to be here, here, though, if I'm being totally honest. He's in prison anyway! If I had to guess... Oh, right! Lenny and Lynette are from the House of the Heart. They work for the Knaves, so they could be here to investigate, too! Wow! Huh? Oh, it's a card! Ah. Uh, I didn't notice it earlier. That's Liddy's. It looks like a magician's prop. Lenny must have left it here. He's in prison and still doing his little tricks, huh? Let Paimon have a look. It was nice to bump into you again. Let's catch up in the production zone tomorrow. What in the world? It's really like he's greeting a buddy on the street. Yeah, because we're, we're old chops. You know, we're it. his ex-lawyers. That proves that he's up to something here, too. If you say so. We can ask him what's going on tomorrow. Let's get some rest now. But, 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 with a bit of trepidation. Good morning. Do they really need that? Do we need that shot of Blue Man? Was hey, that necessary? Well, it's Paimon's first day as a prisoner. Last night, Paimon dreamed about getting that felt, a That felt a little unnecessary. Paimon told them everything, and then Paimon woke up. Your Honor, I did not eat that cake. Hey, come on! It's just a dream, okay? Paimon wouldn't really squeal. Maybe. Oh, uh, okay, buddy. Hey, Lazy Bones, what are you still doing here? If you don't want to starve, then get yourselves over to the production zone. Hey, how dare you call me a Lazy Bones? Hey, we're going right away. Hey, Lazy Bones. All right, let's go to the production zone. These are really spacious, like, prison cells. Yeah, we won't starve even if we're lazy. So, I mean, like, what's the point? God, this music. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, wait, where's the down elevator? How do I make it go down? Is there is there is there a down elevator? Maybe on the other side You go up but the the, the thing says down There's the down one. Yeah, the arrow it literally says down. Alright. Aw, oh, yeah. God, this music is so badass. Man, French and badass do not go together. The longest elevator ride of my life. Ooh. Oh, I want that waypoint though. Oh, you can go even further down? <laughs> God, I love this OST. Must be the catch of the day. Looks like you've got some luck getting assigned this space. Yep, we just arrived yesterday and don't interrupt me when I'm speaking. Oh my god. Yes, sir. 
<laughs> yes, Listen sir. carefully to my instructions. I don't want any mishaps. Oh my Every god. Every machine here is worth more than the both of you. Working around these machines can be very dangerous. Do your job well, and you can eat in the cafeteria after I got sent to horny jail, it's you guys. It's sloppy, and you dine in the infirmary. Anyway, the Fortress of Merope doesn't want to lose a single one of its machines. And it also doesn't want to waste the production potential of any inmate. You got that? You got it. Got it. Your job is to use wow, the I kind of like him. Process widgets. He keeps Paimon Watch quiet. carefully, and make sure you step on the pedal at the right time. If the machine gets jammed, then give it a little maintenance with your fist. Here, take this. Bring me the process widgets, and I'll give you some credit coupons in exchange. Credit coupons? Remodeling must place on process bit. Uh, you hit it. Uh, jump to... Okay. Okay. Once the widget is hot enough to blow, jump to step on the pedal and hit the widget with the hammer. Am I doing this right? Hello? I did, but it worked. Yeah. This one is tolerable. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? Though, since the processing is done by machine, the product is all pretty much the same anyway. All right, I'll pass you for now. And we'll count up how many credit coupons you've earned. Uh, okay. <sighs> I'm exhausted. I know, hard work is hard. Now, right? oh, that Laborous man. jobs, He's man. So straight to the coupon cafeteria. We still need to meet Lenny first, right? We still haven't seen Tartaglia. We just finished up his work, too. He should be around here somewhere. Did Paimon even do anything? No. All right, Lenny. Where are you? Lenny? Mr. Magician? Oh, this had better not be some disappearing act. Hmm. What is this? What? Your luck isn't here, but elsewhere. Try your luck at a near... F what? What? Consider it a gift from fate? What? Consider it a gift from fate? I hear the voice of fate speaking my name in humble supplication. Okay, that's... Alright, we're gonna go here. Consider this a gift from fate. I created another universe and founded paradise. For I, Fischl, uh... and the princess in Earth. Oh. <laughs> I... Hello? Uh... I can't go that far. It won't let me. It won't let me go that far. Is there another one? I do worry about the well-being of Is my retinue it? during my impromptu absence. I'm sure the good people of the Adventurers Guild are absolutely fine, main Fräulein. Where's Lenny? Is he hiding from his duties? Lenny, where are you? 
Oh, I need to walk to the light. The light was over there. Ha. To the light! Is it not saying I I saw the sign? Now I opened up my eyes and now it's happy now. You don't Ooh! <laughs> Cry out my illustrious name. Ah, oh, yeah. Hell yeah, brother. We got ourselves some coupons. We're gonna be rich boys. <laughs> you wish voice lines didn't happen when you use the machines? Yeah, same. Okay, where's Linny? Where are you hiding, you little shit? Where could he literally be hiding? I don't understand. Are you, like, in the box? No. He has to be hiding somewhere. I feel like he wouldn't do hard work. Lenny, where where are you? Is he... Uh... Do I have to keep running elsewhere? Up? Thank you for stretch. Um, bro, they gotta make this stuff more clear. I'm lost, okay? I'm dumb. All right, Linny. Where could he be? <sighs> Did he decide to slack off and sleep the day away? Uh, okay, let's go over here. Linny! Hey, over here. <laughs> He's cute. Oh, you scared Paimon! How'd you appear out of nowhere like that? Oh, you scare so easily now? God, his is outfit is so slooty. These days? You little. Thing we're worried about was trying to find you. <laughs> you little. Sorry, sorry. Come over here and keep it down. I love oh, the men. Lynette. <gasps> Lynette's here. You really are inseparable. Where is she? That's right. My queen. My brother simply can't stand to be away from me. I love Lynette. I love Lynette so much. She's my little meow meow. My little meow meow is here. Oh, I love her. I love her so much. You guys, she's so cute. I, I all I all I all I remember is her going like ta da at the beginning of the first Fontaine quest. Uh, it's not just Lynette. Fremenet is also here. Do you still remember him? Why are all the Why is the entire family here? Oh, you mean that diver from the House of the Hearth, right? Seeing him in the court of Fontaine. That's so pretty. I love her. Now, you even tell us? How did you end up as criminals this time? We fought so hard at court to prove you were innocent, but now it looks like our incredible court battle is for nothing. She's not even C6. Even Listen. The of things can land you in prison these days. I put together a street performance and used the popularity we gained from the Opera House incident to attract a big crowd. Uh huh. And then. Next, I invited several audience members to participate in the show. I love the And Lynette. then, with the entire audience watching, their wallet suddenly disappeared. My brother was charged with theft, and I was charged as his accomplice, having assisted <laughs> him in his crime. Girl. Uh, it really isn't that bad. The missing wallets are all in the leftmost drawer of the Maison Guardianage's big filing cabinet. I mean, listen, we just need to see why were their wallets to just there to be them. taken, huh? Yep, we should be released then. In terms of the magic trick itself, I think the performance went perfectly. <laughs> <sighs> Leave it to Lenny to magic himself into prison. That's not the point, Lenny. The question is, why? Well, what are you two really Indeed. doing here? Last time I hid my identity from you, I promised that I'd tell you absolutely everything if you were angry about it. No more secrets. Uh-huh. So I don't plan on keeping anything from you this time either. 
At the moment, the House of the Hearth's interests don't conf We were instructed oh, by the father of our How house, the How does finding the wallet they stole absolve them of the crime of theft? Because it was just a joke, bro. The 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 wallets are fine. They it was it was for the trick. <gasps> Told you so. See, Paimon guessed right. As for what we're investigating, perhaps you haven't heard. But the fortress of Meropede hides a secret. Some even say that the entire fortress exists just to protect it. The House of the Hearth has been investigating this for a very long time, trying to uncover its mysteries. But recently, all of our informants, including the ones that had infiltrated the guards, suddenly vanished and have not been heard from since. We believe that this is a direct provocation, and it's the reason why we came here. Why is the house so interested about this secret? Father has somehow managed to confirm that Fossilors does not have Fontaine's Gnosis. What? Huh? How did she manage to learn information that important? Whoa, 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 whoa. They're just gonna drop that right? Wait, 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 wait. They, they drop that lore bomb just like that casually? Father has her ways. Many of them are beyond our imagination. I love you. And we've never had the chance to see her at work. But we trust her conclusions. I love you so much. Oh my god, I love you so much. It was this information that led us to suspect Wait, then who has the Gnosis? Gnosis? might be in the fortress of Meripede and is related to that secret. So it's all about the Gnosis again. Well, it's always about that's the Gnosis. About it from our side. How about you two? Did Monsieur Nervulet send you here? Bingo! The name has been applying Bingo. a lot of pressure. She wants to know what happened to Child, so we came here to investigate. Uh... <laughs> Catherine, are you allowed to tell them? You've already said everything. Consider an exchange of information. <laughs> you don't need to worry too much about Guys, that. Guys, she's just asking for a report I don't know if you know this, predicament but as I love pressure. Lynette. Father used the situation as a pretext she should have been to the negotiate five star. two high-ranking officials in the court of Fontaine. She actually just wants to be able to make concessions on this matter for gains elsewhere, almost like a bargaining chip. Sometimes you need an excuse to do things you otherwise couldn't. Do I have a C6, and Lynette? No. And is more valuable than you might imagine. Of course, it's not a complete farce. I like Linny though, but I love Lynette. If we what happened to Master Child too, then diplomatic relations with Fontaine could improve, and Snezhnaya might even be able to adjust its stance a bit. Oh. Is it just Paimon, or does it feel like we're the only ones who actually <laughs> care about Child's situation? The relationship between the Harbingers must be as bad as ever. I wouldn't go that far. Father just has different standards than we do when it comes to what can be sacrificed for an advantage. Bruh. Uh, by the way, I have a suggestion. Why don't we team up? Mm. Even though we have different objectives, we're both here mm. to investigate the fortress of Meripede. I don't know if I trust you, man. It would be more efficient for us to work together. As you know, the House of the Hearth has many reasons to seek the Gnosis, but our highest priority remains resolving the prophesied crisis. You can trust us on that. Can we? Sorry, I must refuse. Mm, see, I told you. Yeah, she's so smart. Is that so? Hmm. Sure enough, it won't be easy to convince them to cooperate if, with us. If Lynette, if Lynette gives us Lynette one kiss. Lynette seems to be thinking pretty hard about something. If Lynette gives us one kiss, I'll do it. I'll do anything. One, one kiss. That's all. That's all I want. That's all. I, that's all I want. It's just what. Just. Just a crumb. Just a crumb. Of course he is. Lenny has been looking forward to a chance to reach an understanding with you ever since last we met. She cares so much or, about her brother. I should say, we were really looking forward to <laughs> I love up you. With you this time. Lynette, just tell them everything. Why don't you? <laughs> this is cute. This is cute. It's okay to open up a little. If all we're doing is sharing info, fine. But I may uh, reconsider if things get serious. <laughs> Very prudent of you. And consistent with your behavior since we first met. That's reasonable enough. And I agreed to cooperate on these terms as well. I was prepared for the worst. But you were actually more agreeable it's than I It's because Lynette's here. If you were by yourself, I would have walked all away. All right, then. There's no time to lose. I have some information to share. So listen carefully. 
Since Lynette and I arrived here, our investigation uncovered the fact that the Fortress of Meripede has a forbidden zone. Oh? Most people just clammed up and wouldn't talk, but after asking the right questions, we were able to confirm the existence of the forbidden zone from the guards. You should be aware of that while you're investigating. The, the forbidden, forbidden zone. zone? <gasps> Could that be where Child disappeared to? You're right, we'll definitely keep that in mind. Oh yeah, where is... I forgot, That's we're looking for him. the most suspicious thing about the fortress that we know of so far. We have a few other unanswered questions, and we'll be investigating those as quickly as we can. Anyway, I hope you find our information useful at least. Yeah, oh, you're fine. Look at the time. You two must be hungry. You should go to the coupon cafeteria and get something to eat. I'll use my cards to get in touch with you again in the future. Oh, that's just what Paimon wanted to hear. Paimon's starving after all that. Bro, we did like two things. We can talk more about the investigation later. Let's go get some grub. Oh, Paimon. I miss Lynette. I miss her. It's been like a day. Oh, I think... Okay, uh... Mm, is it this one? Bro, I don't know which waypoint does what. Did I pick the right one? I think I picked the wrong one. I don't know which one does what! Hello? Hello? How am I? Erm. Erm. Wait, what if I just... What if I just stand here when it falls down? What if, what if I... Oh. Oh. Huh. And that was my magic trick. Thank you so much to Linny and Lynette for setting it up. Ta-da. I created another universe and founded paradise. Yeah, yeah. Okay, this is going to go for like 10 minutes. I need to go pee real quick. I'll be right back. Hear the voice of fate speaking my name in humble supplication. about the well-being of my retinue during my impromptu absence. I'm sure the good people of the Adventurer's Guild are absolutely fine, main foilite. May the glory of the Princessin bring light to this world. I do worry about the well-being of my retinue during my impromptu absence. I'm sure the good people of the Adventurer's Guild are absolutely fine, main foilite.
Okay, I'm back. Hello, where's the exit? Hello? Y'all ever eaten mac and cheese with syrup? What? That doesn't sound very appetizing. <laughs> Although, I can kind of understand if it's like the sweet and savory combo like chicken and waffles. Because chicken and waffles is pretty goaded. Hi back, I'm front. So I can see it tasting good if it's like a chicken and waffles combination, you know? You hey guys, how close am I oh, to the end of this? He wasn't kidding. Today's meal is nowhere near as good as last time. Damn. Oh, who knows how long it'll be until we're lucky enough to get that super tasty Not again. close. Lol. Not close at all. Ah, forget about it then. Okay. We'll just deal with the regular food for the time being. Let's just get out of here as soon as possible. But life here doesn't seem all that bad. Other than the foreman being kind of mean and the work being pretty tiring. You think so, mate? <laughs> Is it all? If I had a coupon for every fish who said that. Seems you fishies still haven't learned your lessons from your life up on the surface. Why is she talking if like that? If you take things at face value, then by the time you reach a dead end, you won't even know how you ended up on that road in the first place. I don't like him. You have some advice for us, old timer? <laughs> I like your attitude. I don't like your attitude. I, can, uh, you in on a little I think he slurs his words Everyone's too much. Everyone's been telling you to just follow the rules and not cause any trouble for yourself. Am I right? <laughs> but what they don't tell you is that the Women, rules are right? exactly what they pretend to be. <laughs> the rules for being a prisoner. Doesn't he look like the most the French man is, to ever French? This place has a lot of hidden rules. Doesn't he just like look French? Huh? Hidden rules? What do you mean? Not everyone knows about those rules. He goes like wee wee you know croissant. Not, once you break one, you might encounter something even worse than death. Oh. What, life? Really? Oh, now you're really scaring poor Paimon. Don't joke around like that. Have any, have some advice for us, old timer? Of course. And I'd say that just disappearing would be one of the better outcomes. Oh? Oh, you mean that if there really are hidden rules, then child's disappearance might have something to do with that? What, like, hidden rules would there be? Uh, like, no jumping on the bed? Case, would you tell us no we banging the other, like, inmates? <laughs> Come on, mate. This is valuable information. Like, okay. What would happen if, like, you really think you can just ask someone got pregnant in the jail? Like, yeah, there's an infirmary, but is there a hospital? Like... Yeah, there, 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 there has to be a rom like a prison romance arc. There has to be. What do you mean, why? Do they sell contraceptives for coupons? Like, I want to know what the rules. I understand, but we don't have many credit coupons yet. Yeah, yeah, I know. Not like I'm going anywhere. Yeah, Just come yeah. talk to me after it's you say. Not like I'm off. going anywhere. Moreover, your new fish, freshly caught. And completely out of your element. What'd be the point in even telling you anything before you've gotten a handle on your new lives? Come and find me once you've been here longer. I'm you came and talked to me. The shop. Just call me VDoc. VDoc? Bye bye now. What are you, a virtual document? What do you mean, VDoc? He left. Just like that. Huh. He's just trying to scare us into buying fake information from him. But I'm still yeah. interested. It might be a good place to start in our investigation. Hidden rules, huh? Hidden rules. Like, like he said, we don't have any coupons and we're still not familiar with I feel like they've the improved place. the lighting in Genshin. Oh, there's nothing we can do about it now. Ah, we were so busy talking, we almost forgot to eat. Even if it's not the best, it's probably better while it's warm. Come on, dig in before it gets cold. Is he related to Sea Dog? <laughs> I 
All right. We must go up. Uh, there's one. Okay, I'm learning. I'm learning the maps. All right, official baby girly pop. Let's go. Who's your guys' favorite character? And why is official? Allo, you're a liar. So Paimon just confirmed with the guards that I shipped his Cookie, set Nahida, every Farina, Yai, still Amber? But it seems like most of the other inmates choose to continue working through the afternoon to earn more credit coupons. Oh, and they also said that you can use coupons to skip work in the morning and free up your time. Oh. You weren't kidding. Credit coupons really can be used to do anything here. Damn. Ah, oh, Paimon's so tired. And we'll need to wake uh, up and go to Sino, work in the morning. darling. Without any credit coupons, it's not like we can really do anything else. Hmm. Nighty night, Traveler. Paimon hopes we can keep making progress on our investigation tomorrow. I don't understand the coupon structure. Because, like, I would just take my life easy if I could just get my free meal a day. Whoa, what's going on? Oh, we still have his vision! What's going on? I hear someone calling. Do you think that if his butt itches, you would feel it through his vision? Why would you say that? I love Ed Sheeran. I don't understand. What was the point of that? I dreamed of child. Rather, in the dream, I was Is child. that even possible? Well, Unless yeah, it just happened. It wasn't an ordinary dream? Oh, <gasps> child's vision! So, you had it with you this whole time? Maybe the vision connected child's consciousness to yours! Maybe I can use this vision to see everything he experienced from his perspective. And our investigation has its first Good thing you brought the vision with you here. So what did you see in the dream? Do you know where child went? Huh. Okay. Well, hopefully it'll be a bit more helpful in the future. What's more important now is that it's the start of another new day of prisoners. He didn't fight in the ring. I know, right? He didn't even go to fight club. What's the plan for today? Uh, let's work at the production zone. Let's go! It's time to start working. If that guard fielding catches us skulking about... Yeah, 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 yeah. It's time to go to work. We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful Wizard of Oz. Oh, it's Gohan again. Look who decided to show up. Get your butts in gear and get to work. Time's a-wasted. Already Got on it. There you go. Remember to give me... Yeah, 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 yeah. I feel like this is like where they made the mechs that attacked Navia. All right. Okay. This is so easy, bro. Oh. Whoops. Oi! Easy. 
God, I wish work was this easy, man. Oh, I'm on speed. But after so many shifts, it seems we're really getting the hang of it now. All you do is float around telling me what to do. Hey there, fellow shift mates. I saw you finished your work, hi, so Rowan. I thought I'd come over and say hi. Oh, hey there. We've seen you before. Your assigned workspace is really close, isn't it? <laughs> That's right. The name's uh, Rowan. Hi, Rowan. These past few days, I couldn't help but notice the new faces working nearby. I guess we were destined to meet. What? I've been working here for almost 15 years. Yeah, Even damn. Even the foreman Grainville always calls me Chief. Wow, you've been working here a long time, Chief. So in other words, you haven't managed any improvement in 15 years? Hey, not so loud. <laughs> if there's anything you'd like to know, just ask me. I'm just me. saying, 15 years, same job. Come on, man. The back of my hand. All right, Chief. We'll be sure to come to you first. Uh, I think we've got the work more or less down pat. Did you just ask about the rules? No, I didn't. <laughs> Pretty sharp for newcomers. You've already heard about the rules, what? huh? Where'd I... you hear it from? Wait, I I literally did not ask about I did not ask about the rules. I I literally said we more or less know what's going on already. Hmm. Alright. Seeing as I'm the one who came over here, you're already calling me cheap. Rules are meant to be broken. Truth is, you two keep working like this, you might be putting yourselves in danger. Huh? Wait, there's even a rule about that? Wait, but we're just working what like normal. You never told us about this. Well, it's usually not that easy to break one on accident. The conditions of the hidden rules are usually pretty specific. Okay. But once you do break one, bad things happen. Bad things, huh? If you work continuously in the production zone for three days, and if all you do besides eating and sleeping is just work, then something bad will happen during lunch on the third day. Huh? Why? Like what? Oh, don't scare Wait, why? So you can't just <laughs> if I knew that do your job and go to sleep and eat? You. Now would I? Well, now mm -hmm. we have to go do everything. Even you have never tried working three days like that before. There's actually a legend about this rule. They say that there was a worker who worked way harder than me. He was both efficient and eager on the job. He worked and way most harder other than me. Couldn't hold a candle to him. One time, he tried to test his limits and worked as long as he could. Then during lunch on the third day, uh-huh, he disappeared into thin air, as if he'd evaporated. Later, some people went and asked some of his past friends about him, but mm -hmm. they said, "Never heard of the guy." Oh shit. What the? How could that happen? What the what? What did the worker look like? Unfortunately, we were assigned different production zones. I never saw for myself what he looked like. Useless, Rowan. Wait. Are you thinking that it was. We'll give it a try. Huh? Oh? Yeah, we're on day you... two. <sighs> Listen, kid. This ain't the kind of thing you should be curious about. Let me tell you, you're better off forgetting about it and looking after yourself. Now I kind of regret ever telling you. Yeah, I agree with Chief here. Do you really want to try? Nothing ventured, nothing gained. Uh, all right, if you insist. Yeah, don't be a wimp. Oh, we got a chest? Garbage. Ooh, it looks disgusting. Oh, Paima misses your cooking. Oh, we lost the 50-50, huh? What would you like to do this afternoon? We have 800 credits. Let's go work in the production zone. But Paima really hopes the foreman will be in a... Bum, 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 bum. I'm back. Look who we love to, to work. Up. Get your butts in gear and get to work. I to waste it. Good. Here you go. I love working. You guys, don't we love to work? Bruh. Okay. Come on! Oh, whoops, okay. 
Working is so fun. Let me have a look. Yeah, 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 yeah. All we do is eat, work, sleep. Eat, work, sleep. Ooh, we woke up so early today that Paimon's been nodding off all afternoon. Good thing it's finally time for bed. It's bed time. Bum, 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 bum. <sighs> the dawn of a new day. Paimon feels like we're getting used to life as convicts. Uh, is that a good thing or a bad thing? <laughs> what do you have planned for us? Is it good or bad, huh? Complete the following objectives during the time in the Fortress of Metropide to advance the story. While working the morning shift, apply for continuous working shifts with Grainville. Choose to go to the production zone in the morning and gather information. Okay. Well, let's go work. Wait, we just... I love to work. It pays the bills. Wait, there's no bills to pay? Man, I don't get it. I don't know what we're working for. Decided to show up. Okay, you, you have said this every Time's single time. Uh oh? What's with suddenly wanting to work so hard? You need coupons that badly? Yeah. Sure. Let's just say we really want to test our limits. We gotta push it, push it to the limit, limit. Cause we're in it to win it, in it to win it. Oh yeah. Nice. We did well today. Oh, Lumin is so <laughs> cute. That was really cute of Lumin. And we're zooming. I mean, what else are you supposed to do in jail, huh? Not work? There's not like I can, like, a phone I can be on. Widgets would be so tiring. Oh, that's it. Paimon doesn't even have the energy to talk anymore. Is Calm down, Paimon. You finish your morning work and arrive at the coupon cafeteria. Oh, I'm exhausted. It's just work. Come on, you're not even doing work. anything. Paimon's little body can't handle this much longer. <gasps> Wait a sec. Now that Paimon thinks about it, haven't we been working nonstop for three? Oh, Paimon feels a shiver going down her spine. What's going to happen? I feel like it's just an urban what? legend. It doesn't seem like anything's changed at all. And we made it to the coupon cafeteria safely. Are the so-called hidden rules only a rumor after all? Don't get your hopes up. That would be quite a disappointment. Well, there's no use to just guessing all day. Paimon's stomach has been grumbling the whole time. Let's just eat already. What if the rumor just started because they lost like the 50-50 on the lunch Maybe meal? We'll get the super lucky meal. Wait. Ooh. What? This is. What in the world is this? What's with Paimon's food? And yours is. That's food. creepy. Is this stuff meat? But it looks and feels so good. Um, yeah, Ryden right was, was cooking, man. Like Whoever's cooking in the kitchen needs to stop. What These are like my theories. Is this the bad thing that Rowan was talking about? No. Stop right there. Paimon gets what you mean. Just don't say it. Hey. Do we have to eat it? Isn't that Wolsey over there? He must have made the food, right? All so stats, negative 50. the food and be done with it. Hey, Wolsey. Have a moment? Hmm? What is it? I'm about to go report the numbers for today's free meal, so you'd better make it quick. Uh, um. It's about the meat in our meals. Look. It's a little sussy-wussy. Normal to you? To me? Oh, that. Oh, it's that? Fine to me. Totally normal. You better hurry up. What is oh, that? Uh, how could this be fun? Hey, don't leave. You barely even looked at it. Hey! <laughs> uh, what should we do now? Wolsey wouldn't even give us the time of day. 
The plot thickens. Awa, 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 Yeah, looks like we have no other choice. Paima was positively famished a minute ago, but now she's lost her appetite. It thickens. Strange meat. That is sussy wussy meat. What would you like to do this afternoon? Wow, we have so many credits from working. Okay, let's see if we can find any new leads. The way it didn't let me go back to work, I would have worked longer. I I would have been a worker. All right, I have to go. Let's see. Uh, over here. Mimer, thank you for wasting 5,000 channel points on absolutely nothing, you pathetic piece of shit. Literally wasting all those channel points on garbage. Are you not ashamed of yourself for being a literal piece of shit? I hear the voice of fate. You are nothing. You are pathetic. You're a literal freaking degenerate. Can you open your mouth? Right now, open it nice and wide. You ready to go? Ah, uh, ah, uh. <laughs> pathetic. All of you, pathetic. Now scatter, scatter. All right. My name in humble supplication. Let's see. What am I looking for? Okay, there's one over here, I think. <laughs> you just come and got spitted? Yeah, buddy. Scatter. <laughs> huh? Rowan? Uh, what are you doing here, Chief? Yeah, what you doing oh, here, buddy? Uh, I was injured a bit just now. Nothing major. I think I just pulled something. A little mm. mishaps like this are unavoidable at work, you know? That's suspicious. Yeah. I wouldn't have thought someone as experienced as the chief would still get hurt on the job. I just knew you would say that. This is pretty embarrassing. Uh, yeah, you're not actually the chief, CG are you? you need her anyway? The one time I need to make a quick trip to the infirmary. Oh, you mean she wasn't in the infirmary? Oh? Yeah. The rumors say that there's never anybody in the infirmary in the half hour before lunch. And nobody knows where Siegewin gets off to. Siegewin? Huh. So this isn't just a coincidence, but she's always absent during huh. lunch? That's actually really strange. Siegewin's always super dedicated to her work. Where else would she possibly go? Yeah, where would she go? Uh, forget it. I can take care of a small sprain like this on my own anyway. No need to trouble her. Empty infirmary. Herm, 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 herm. Oh my God, Lynette! Lynette, my love, my lovely, my lovely baby angel. I love her. Oh, I love her so much. I want to be higher up. I love her. I I really do. I really do adore. I adore Lynette so much. I think she's really cute. Will I build her in the future? Maybe. Oh, wonderful. I was worried that you'd be busy trying to earn reward coupons all the time. But it seems like you haven't neglected your investigation work after all. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? likes having more coupons, but no one wants to work all the time. Have you also been investigating coupons. the area, Lynette? No, I was just slacking off. <laughs> you happened to catch me. <laughs> I love her. 
Oh, I love her. She's so relatable. Oh, I love her so much. My brother is still obsessed with anything remotely related to the Forbidden Zone. But knowing him, it won't be long before we get more leads. Oh, before I forget. I really like her voice. This is for you. Huh? Credit coupons? Why are you giving us these? Yeah, the coupons. I've been here longer than you. Coupons aren't a resource in particularly short supply. God damn. What is in short supply are interesting people to talk with. Oh, that's so nice of you, Lynette. We'll be sure to make good use of these coupons then. Oh my god, it's Lynette! I love her. I adore her. My itty bitty octo baby. My little octo baby. Hey, look. All right. There's something here. A book. Hmm. Looks like a research notebook. That suspicious guy peeking into the infirmary just now. Are they a fan of Sea Dream? He must have dropped this. Let Paimon read it real quick. The Melisi perceive the world very differently from humans. There are significant deviations. As a result, their sense of aesthetics and beauty is also very different from that of humans. Huh. This must be taken into consideration when giving gifts. Ooh. Did I wail on your roulette banner? No, I'm not pulling for he him. Sure did his homework. Hello, welcome. Welcome, Alex. Uh. And as for the notebook, <laughs> let's take it. It's ours now. Finders keepers. We're saving everything for Navia. And maybe maybe one one singular Farina. Alright, let's see where I gotta go over here. Guys, I miss Lynette. I know we just talked to her, but I miss her again. Hello, Fitzroy. Oh hello. You two are the ones who were with His Grace. No need to be so nervous. What about Chlorin? Oh, sorry, I couldn't help but think of His Grace once I saw you, and I... Uh, I might skip her. I might skip Chlorin. Oh, it's hard to say. Maybe I am. It depends how much Navia hurts me. Presence. It makes me feel like I'm just some insignificant little bug. Wait, seriously? Well, I'm always indecisive, and I tend to make a mess of things. It's like a reflex. I just instantly start to tense up the moment I see a smart and capable person like his grace. Oh my god. It depends on how badly Navia hurts me, okay? What? F please, don't say anything like that out loud. How could you possibly think something like that? Let's see. Oh, we must go lower. Oh, that's the up elevator. There's a down elevator. Okay. Bum, 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 bum. Navia better come home on under a thousand. Man, I am hoping so. Hey, Genshin Impact, you want to sponsor my stream when whenever Navia comes out? I would appreciate that greatly. You don't even need to pay me. Just reimburse me for however much Navia cost. God, this elevator's so long. Do you guys ever jump when going down in an elevator? Huh. Oh, there she is. Hey, yo, what's up, kiddo? Why are you here? See, Jwing? Aren't you supposed to be in the infirmary? What are you doing in the production zone? Hello, traveler. Paimon. Everyone's She's really cute. Busy around now, and we don't have any patients I think they made the kid models less punctable. 
I thought I'd come here and enjoy like, the sight of everyone. I don't know. I don't, I don't have the urge to punch her like I do with uh, Chi Chi. Oh, uh, what's there to enjoy here? Or at least like as aggressively. It's really worth watching. Like I one punt would be nice. Like affectionately. Humans are just so interesting and adorable. I like to watch your expressions while you work. Uh, are you talking about pets or people? Oh, I can see why you think that, but you shouldn't jump to conclusions. See, we Melazines are a different species. Melazines. And we see the world very differently from humans. It's very easy for me to observe everyone's condition. All it takes is one look, and I can tell which workers are exhausted. Wait, Melazines can see that? Wait. Huh. That Wait. does sound useful for being Wait. a nurse. Aren't the Melazines... Those little animal creatures? Right? The, the little animal things that... And, and... And she... And she's half human. Half that. So you're telling me. Who... Who, who did it? Wait... Wait... I don't know which side is worse. Someone did that to a melazine? Yeah. Yes. Running around tending to everyone's health is very fulfilling. But I'd much prefer it if you're all happy and free from exhaustion and pain in the first place. Take care of your body. Make sure you eat well. How's the story quest so far? It's pretty good. This part's a little slow, but I don't like dislike it or hard. anything. Take care of ourselves. We probably won't finish Let's it today, it though. I'm getting pretty tired. Don't we have to be up tomorrow. Uh, we have to be up pretty early tomorrow. Um. Huh. Oh, Deacon, what's up? How's not getting that promotion? Hey, it's the Traveler and Paimon. <laughs> No need to tease me, okay? Are we streaming till the I live stream? No, I'm gonna twice. sleep and we'll wake up and stream Just the live like stream. Just like his grace said, paying attention to every little detail is the key to prosperity. Hmm. Maybe this is the true meaning of rebirth. Not just earning credit coupons. Oh my god, he's growing! Wow. Okay, and now we must go over here. Which is on this floor. The live stream is at 7.30 in the morning Eastern time. Uh, I will start stream at 6.30 in the morning Eastern time. Uh, he'd give you some coupons if you were nice to him before. Well, he wasn't nice to me. Why should I be nice to him? You just did you just did you just comment on my resin? Did 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 someone just comment on my on my resin in the Lord's year of Whale behavior. Oh, you want to stop investigating and go rest? It's time for rest. Okay. You should rest up. We'll be back at it tomorrow. Okay. Wow, is that a good so after working place to end it? Straight, she said good night. We'll, we'll, we'll talk about it tomorrow. Meat our lunch. What was that all about? Hmm. Our oh, we're doing like a recap right now. Like that part of the investigation is really? at a dead end. Well, we'll keep searching for more clues tomorrow. Good night, traveler. Good night. Ding bong, ding dong. Ding dong, oh, ding bong. Paimon doesn't want to get up. Paimon still feels completely exhausted from yesterday. What do you have planned for? How much longer do I have left on this?
Uh, should we skip work? Or do we... Do we go to work? Do we love to work gamers? Or do we go... Do we skip work? We should go, we should go to work. Skip? Never skip. Skip one hour. Be a good corpo slave. I must escape the corporate cycle. You don't think there's a point in skipping? Okay. After working here so long, we're really starting... But doing the same thing all the time can get old pretty quickly. Bro, that's me and my domains. Yeah, it's good to kick back and relax once in a while. What's going on? We apply with Grainville to do some simpler processing tasks. Oh, you only just now got the notification. I'm so sorry. Oh, just a regular meal set. Guess Paimon shouldn't get her hopes up. Uh huh. What would you like to do this afternoon? I love to work. Maybe we'll be able to find. All right, gamers. I think we'll probably end it here for tonight. I'm sorry it's a little earlier than usual. But we do have a 6 in the morning stream tomorrow uh, to do. So, I mean, you won't miss me for that long. Um, I created another universe thank you guys for the stream. Purpose. I hope you enjoyed some Genshin's of gym Fischl. packs. And the princess and Prin Fischl, 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 I love you, queen. Shut up. Um, tomorrow, we have the 6 a.m. stream. Also, tomorrow's a pretty exciting meeting that I have. Uh, with Potentially will affect the future of this channel. So, you know, you know, pretty, pretty exciting stuff is happening tomorrow that I can't really talk about just yet. But yeah, we have the live stream tomorrow and whatnot. Uh, Saturday, we'll probably play some Baldi's Gate. So, no, not corporate VTuber. No, no, no. I'm not going corporate, you guys. Don't worry. I, you guys are stuck with me. No matter what hap whatever, no matter what happens in the future, I'm always going to be Mina and I'm always going to be here. But there is some fun stuff that might affect the future of this channel. And th in that regards, it means more of like the production quality of this channel of versus me disappearing into the sea of butterflies. Sure the good of the God, they talk so much in the background in this fine, game. But, but, but yeah, don't worry. I'm not going anywhere, you guys. I'm not going corporate. So you guys are stuck with me. I'm an indie, I'm an indie forever at heart. Um, thank you guys. You joined at the end. Yeah, it's been three hours, man. We'll stream again in... And like six hours are... but thank you guys for for the stream i appreciate you all uh do, 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 what raid sweetheart uh do, 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 do. there's the ice there's, uh, do, 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 do. yeah the mods are stuck forever uh if you are subscribed go ahead use the one with the little cheer emotes if you are not subscribed use the one with the green hearts uh, be nice, be kind, be re uh, polite, be respectful. You guys are a direct reflection of me and someone else's community. So please, uh, you know, please reflect that uh, when talking in someone else's chat. Um, but, 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 uh, 6 a.m. tomorrow is the, the Honkai Star Rail live stream. So we'll be watching that. Uh, Saturday is Baldi's Gate. What else is there? Is there anything else? Anything else uh, that I, hear the I have to announce? Speaking my name I don't think so. Uh, spam that raid message. I think it's really cute when people spam raid messages. I'm gonna go to sleep. I've been really sleepy uh, since I've been at the salon earlier today. So, yeah. I'm gonna go. I'm, I think I'm gonna sleep early tonight. Thank you guys so much. I'll see you in a few hours. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye.